Yeah. All right. Hey, uh, up on All right. How you doing? All right. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry to hear about that. Hey, that, sound, that doesn't sound fun. All right. Excellent. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry to hear about that. Hey, that doesn't sound fun. All right. Excellent. 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 Uh, oh, I've right. managed to find a bedroom. Oh, I'm sorry to hear about that. Hey, that sounds. Right. Right. All right, okay, let's okay. pull this apart. Sorry for the fact you all can't see anything there at the moment. That does kind of suck. So if I go over here, <laughs> Discord. Oh, it's Discord call FFF me uh, Jess. That's the scenes we're using. Okay. Studio Let's Run a quick test and make sure that I can hear my bad self. Oh, that's why I've got it. I've what? got it. What? 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 Wrong, wrong. It's because we're in a different chat. It didn't pick up the window. Ooh. There we go. That's blown out. We'll fix that up in a second. Uh, but that's okay. If you need to move us to a different channel, Kev, go nuts. No, it's all good. It's easier just to move the scenes temporarily. There we go. Yay! There we are. All right, I'm just going to uh, change my green screen properties temporarily. Mm -hmm. This is an afternoon where definitely I I have very little I have very little fucks to give about whether that is blown out or not. But uh, let's <laughs> see if I can if I can tamper with these lights and get that not doing a thing quite as much. I didn't think I got I didn't think I got uh, ambient light in this room, but apparently I do because that affects that affects how much I need of this. Uh, there we go, that's still Alright. That's not bad. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Bless you. Bless you, what's going on there? Oh, you know, probably the usual Hey Fever <coughs> Oh excuse me. Oh no. Bloody hell. Yeah, occasion it'll just come on real harsh and then it'll it'll just back off for like no oh. reason I can fathom that's the worst um also now that my brain is here <laughs> now that my brain is here folks uh we are also joined by the delightful Gemma aka story girl yay um, yeah. hello how you doing yeah I'm uh, tagging along you know me no you were saying before you're on you're on holidays this week do I have that right uh, yeah, it's, um, end of semester break. Beautiful. Oh, fantastic. What you been up to? Very little. Uh, main, mainly watching some actual play RPG stuff, so. Oh, uh, nice. What's know. been on your list? Don't know if you've heard of Dimension 20? Yes, I have. Um, Brendan, uh, uh Bre oh, Brendan Lee Mulligan, yeah. Oh, Brendan Lee Mulligan is one of my favourite people in the, um... He does Cracked, isn't it? I think? Uh, I'm not sure is about it... Cracked. He was part of, um... Or he is part of, uh, College Humour. College Humour, that's the one. I couldn't remember which team it was, but his CEO skits fucking love him. Yeah, he's he's very sharp. But his, mm. his actual play RPG stuff is just dynamite. Like, really Oh, fantastic. Cool. Got it. Alrighty. Um, I should join you all in game. Why not? Well, if yeah. if you finish patching, go nuts. I have indeed finished patching. Excellent. I like that son. Your your brain is that what we're calling Colin and Gemma? Yes, that is. That's a hundred percent. Hey, if completely can earned. do me a favor and pop over to my stream for a sec just to see if the sound is okay i'm just having a hard time getting through on my other pc for testing or maybe if i just reload everything will be fine let me know hang on give me a second i'll do it on my other computer and so that's always the concern i mean i'm not i'm not so concerned about the um the video, because the video is definitely not working. Again. 
But oh, what's really? happening? What's happening with your what's happening with your video? Ah, uh, Streamlabs is being an ass and not picking up on um, on um, good old um, Discord. Actually, you know what? Uh, I might do one other thing. If I can remember what that thing was, and it just flew out of my head. It's not reliable, me being a brain right now. Sorry, Dreamers sorry. with audio that doesn't work do this one crazy thing. <laughs> <laughs> Which uh, hates it. Oh, nah. Sure, I'll think of it some other time. Probably later on tonight when I'm asleep. Mm hmm. Anyway, audio I can test now, so. Let's see. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's a bit of a hiss there, but you're coming through. Oh, cool. Alright. Yeah. It sounds like you've got your gain on your stream, but like bumped, re bumped really high. Hmm. Let's have a look here. There is basically like if you if you want to get rid of that, there is a um a noise reduction filter in Oh hang on, bear with me. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna Hang on. Fuck. <laughs> oh wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I just need to go and uh, not drown, uh, slash, uh, die of lack of oxygen. Mm -hmm. How about that? Sorry, y'all. I that can't, can't hear. Oh, hang on. I've got the thing. What's the need to do? What am I doing? It's going to be like this this afternoon, folks. I'm going to be squirrely. I think all of us are going to do Not this. squirrely. Uh, <gasps> there he is. Scattered. There's the guy. There we go. You're All right, now I can hear folks over here. Okay, I have to like having played this for two weeks. I have to remind my not played this for two weeks. I have to remind myself what exactly I'm doing. Uh, uh. <laughs> oh dear. Hang on. Some benches and shit. We have to. What make. am I hearing? All right, folks. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna mess with video again for a sec. It's gonna. Um, Gemma, you're, yeah. you've got some, do you have like some white noise coming through on your end or somewhere in your environment? Uh, I'm only seeing, uh, I'm, it might be the heater on, but, uh, I'm not seeing my mic triggering. Yeah, just to me, just to me. Let me just, uh, okay. bump the threshold a little though. Um, yeah, sorry, Carl. Happens. I realized. Hmm? Yeah, I realized I could hear the white noise on my end as well. Oh. Yeah, thank you. Whatever you've done there, Gemma, is. Uh... Yeah, see, it's it's still. It, I don't know what it is, it's but it's doing? it's still coming through. That's okay. We can live with it. It's just knowing what it is. That's all. Oh no, no, no. It, it, I can probably filter it a bit further. Um... Oh, that's okay. Don't stress. Like, I, I don't want to, I don't want to make life, make, make work for other folks as well. Hey, Cole, welcome to the stream, Von Explainer. Lovely to have yeah. you here. Hello. Two Collins are better than one. Are they though? <laughs> I mean, I can leave. Well then, yeah. <laughs> oh, is that is that the right is that the path you're going down, yeah. Colin? We have love in our hearts for multiple Collins here. Okay. All right. All right. Ah, oh. hmm. well, fuck me! What are we doing? We're doing space things. Oh yeah, you bet. Yeah. All right. Oh, I'll fix the video back up as well. From sixteen to fifteen. But yeah, don't stress too much about that, Gemma. For me, it was just knowing what it was coming from because I thought the to begin with it was me. It was my audio, and I was worried about that. Yeah, you're all good. No, Colin, don't leave. 
Look, I love you, Cole. <coughs> even though, even though Colin on stream is jealous of the primacy of Collins and wants to wants to claim that for himself. I offered to leave first, actually. <laughs> mm. I'm about to you ask. Just need, for... need someone to leave. I mean, I... <laughs> don't, don't you dare. No, <laughs> you leave, we die. <laughs> So true. Mm. Uh, let's see. Uh, All right. What are we doing? In fact, now that we're in space. Yeah. Real what, true. Because uh, we got up. Oh, hold on, hang on. Let me just suss out where we're at. Oh, yeah, oh machine bench. Hmm. So we got to we got to go on an expedition. So we got to uh, yeah. gear up. So a right. mighty cold one. Oh, we're going into the cold. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. Okay. Ah, canteens would probably be a good idea, wouldn't they? It says, please, as if anyone could come between this bro man. <laughs> Very nice. Pulled out on stream. You know what? I don't do it on Wednesday nights, but I'm going to put my goddamn poncho on right now. Because I am right. cold. Yeah. Some people call me the space cowboy. And they'd be right. Oh. Um. Steel. That's all we need. Uh, and there's probably not a lot much iron around here, is there? Mm, yeah, 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 I need... Oh, wait, no, there's some steel sitting right there. <clears throat> uh, can I then make... Oh, yeah, here's some canteens coming out of everybody's way. Make things a little bit easier. So, where do you want that canteen, Kev? Ah, oh, that's better. Oh, he was off stream. <laughs> hey, Gemma, where do you yeah, want your sorry. canteen? Uh, I've got one. I'm good. Oh, okay. Either. Then that's a spare. Yeah, it's. It's uh, took me longer to put on a poncho than I expected it to. Uh, right, right. Well, there's a canteen on the machining bench there for you. All right. Let's do that. Uh, let's see. Pro Road AU, aka Adam, how the heck are you? How is life tre treating you at the moment? I heard tell, I heard rumor you might be headed Melbourne way this year. <gasps> what? That's right, going to Melbourne. Oh, my video is frozen. Oh no! But you're smiling, so, uh, like 50%, 50% nice, 50% creepy? <laughs> I'm okay on my Discord end, so it might be your end, Kev. Oh, let's, let's all just blame Kevin. Let's all just fucking blame Kevin. I'm fine with that. Look, Kevin, oh. I'm sorry, it is your fault. I, I'm, I'm okay with that. <laughs> well, it's not a fucking democracy, okay? <laughs> all right yeah it's it's my discord source all right i'm gonna go to chat mode and then come back right look it doesn't have to be anyone's fault no i mean uh, it it is basically that would be i feel like that's very close to being your pick if this was the opening of like an 80s sitcom though cole hmm this like just freezes and then my my name appears underneath it yeah, exactly, exactly. Starring. You'd be... Yeah. I've yeah. actually done commercials like that. It's so good. Oh, wow. <laughs> that sounds awesome. Speaking of uh, 80s sitcom mode, uh, I, oh. I think there's there's a real missed opportunity here in terms of um, it had to be Kevin. Hmm. Uh, as, as the title, the title of the show. Yeah, right. <laughs> nice. All right, there we go. Your video is unfrozen. I fixed that. Thank 
Kate may be, may be in bed under a doona. That sounds amazing. No, I just oh. realized why my weight capacity has gone to shit. Why is that? Because you're not solo. I'm not playing solo. Uh, no, we've ruined it for you. <laughs> you're like, what's the, member of what's the member of Mystery Men who can go invisible when no one's watching? It's like that. I'm yeah, a right. superhero when you're not around. <laughs> oh, shit, I just realized I got a new episode of The Boys to watch. Yeah. Oh, man. I got turned off that. That show is a lot. It lie. is. I recognise it's not for everyone. <laughs> um, it's gore level more than anything else. It kind of turned up, turned me off. The whole okay. thing. Um, yeah. It became an exercise in kind of um, wondering how someone's going to explode this episode. Yeah. Right. Um, you know, one of the things that keeps me coming back. Sorry, actually, keep going. Keep going. Hmm. Yeah. I just realized they're going to talk over you. Yeah. But That's disappointing yeah, because but, I, I do like the um, the treatment of of uh, of the of the issues that it's bringing up. Uh, the acting's great and cinematography's great. Um, yeah, right. I nearly lost it when they did the Imagine video. I can't believe that they did that because I don't know if you remember the point in the pandemic where a bunch of celebrities were like, what if we all just do a video of us all just singing Imagine? That'll make things better, right? Uh... Yeah, the stuff they do, the deep, I feel like the the plot lines they do with that sort of um, just completely satirizing um, the whole sort of celebrity mindset is fucking gold. But yeah, I get you on the gore. The gore is absolutely, it's very extreme. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. For me, it, for me, it's more just a, a matter of I'm not a member of the audience that they need to reach with that. Oh, okay. right. Yep, yep. So I it's like, that. you know, yeah, I, I, I get all this. This is this is all shit that happens, and it's horrible, and I don't like it. Make it go yeah. away. Mm. Don't need to consume it. <laughs> yeah. Completely fair. Hey, do we have any coal at the moment? Uh, there's a coal deposit um, just up the hill a bit. All right. Um, um, if folks don't mind, I might make myself just a steel pickaxe and then go at it. Yeah. I, if if you guys, what what are you guys hoping to achieve in this session today? Um, because like obviously there's lots that could be achieved, but. If I know roughly what you're aiming for, I can do what I can to help facilitate that as opposed to just doing my own thing, which is kind of what I'm currently planning to do unless anyone else says otherwise. Gotcha. Well, um, Cole, did you want to speak first on that? Oh, you know, just keep on equipping up, I guess. Um, yeah. Let's, let's load for bear. Literally and figuratively. Oh, okay. Yeah, um, polar, in po polar bears make normal bears look like little babies. Guess. I saw a diagram. I they saw a diagram of a rude. brown bear next to a polar bear, and a little part of me inside died. <laughs> <laughs> they are fucking massive. You are not mm. wrong. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but in in terms of game mechanics, they are a lot. They are faster they ha than a brown bear. They or black bear rather. Mm -hmm. They have a much wider white radius. Gotcha. So they, they can swap you um, unerringly as opposed to brown bear, uh, black bears, which will sort of, you know, you can kind of dodge them a bit. Can they swim? Uh, yes. Oh, well, we're toast. Yeah, they're... I mean, they're I... Go ahead. Complete nutter bastards. <laughs> yeah, arguably they should be the best swimmers out of all the bears. Yeah. And probably are. Um, yeah, so, and they have, like, three or four thousand hit points. So they take <laughs> a lot of killing. Yeah, Fuck me. Um, okay, well, my personal goals are, I would like to, um, I would like to start sort of getting out there and harassing the wildlife. 
and getting up, getting some fur armor together for folks, mm -hmm. um, and also getting, also working towards a um, just a basic hunting rifle. Oh, your fur armor is here. Oh, yeah. it's already there. Yep. Yeah, I did make a couple of suits of fur armor. I, I figured oh, sure. that 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 was trivial enough that I didn't need to. Gem has oh, been on bless. it. <laughs> Thank you so much. Um, so if you look at the, it, it's sitting in the appropriate bench. Yeah. Hey, Kath, welcome to the stream. How the Hello. heck are you? How on? is your Sunday going? Where did you say that uh, coal deposit bot was, by the way, Gemma? Um, uh, just roughly is fine. It's so if you go north from the camp, yeah, uh, up the hill, past the first uh, sort of mine on the left-hand side of the cliff. That that's so, approximate. So it's on the left-hand side of the cliff. Yeah. But okay. you might have to go a little bit further than you think I might Okay, mean. so <laughs> is, that, is that roughly sort of in O10 or? Uh, let's see. It'll be O10-ish, yeah. Yeah, cool. All right. Maybe O9. Cool. You want to head over there? Hi. I'm out. Cute. I'm just going to eat some, going to eat some meats. Sounds good to me. Alright. Uh, do I want anything else in the meantime? No, I've got a good knife. I'm gonna head out. Cute. Oh, rain. Ugh. It can't rain all the time. Can't rain all the time. <laughs> um, my partner watched that again the other night. Oh, what'd she think? She's like, it is aged really well. Um, yeah. yeah, that's the impression I got as well. Sorry, and folks, for um, for those of you who weren't um, tragic goths or borderline goths in the nineties, the film we are referring to is the original Crow with Brandon Lee, released nineteen ninety four. Hmm. Excuse me. There is got there is scuttlebutt that there's going to be a um, that there's going to be a reimagining of the first story with um, Bill Skarsgård. God. Which I'm kind of intrigued about because I've seen him in Castle Rock. He was really good there. I've seen him in. Um, he is fantastic in it. Mm -hmm. oh, I'll just grab this um, sulfur. Do it. Do it. You were a child. You were a child in the nineties. Yeah, it's too early. Just a little too early. I'm sorry to say, Kate, you missed you missed the decade that had the best music. You missed grunge. Except in hindsight. You missed the tail end of the new of the new romantic wave. <laughs> oh my god, Adam did a video about the Crow Wicked Prayer. God. So like all franchises, for those of you who don't know, the Crow uh, had the Crow had a really strong original film um, directed by Alex Proyer. Uh, and then there was a sequel. And I hold that the sequel is a good addition to the franchise, which is City of Angels with um, Vincent Perez. And it actually has a it has a, a part with Iggy Pop. Um, I think that's not a bad addition to the franchise. But then past there, there are sequels that are just fucking travesties. <laughs> Should be around here. Okay. On the west side of the cliff. Oh, it feels good to be sitting down and doing nothing. Well, nothing physically. Virtually. <laughs> I did know that Kirsten Dunst is in Crow Salvation. I'm pretty sure I've watched parts of Crow Salvation. That's the one. Yeah. Is it that or Wicked Prayer where the, the, the makeup appears... Like mystically. Yeah, Cole, of course, please. Tell us tell us something that you're excited about. Please Cole, share. Yeah. We'd love to hear. Do it. Fucking all. 
Bowls. Uh, Luce loved the crow. Excellent. Have we gone too far? Maybe. We've gone too far, Colin. Uh, yeah, you have gone past the, the little coal deposit that I'm thinking of. But if you keep going oh, is, further is around, there's a mine. Oh. Is it an oh okay? It's an outside coal deposit. That's my bad. That's my bad. I was yeah, looking for yeah, a mine, yeah. but I probably ran straight past uh, it. Ah, right now. Well, we should probably just keep going then. Yeah. All right, let's keep going to the mine. Let's do, let's do a mine. I'm excited. Yeah. Let's do a mine. Mine, 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 <laughs> mine. Mine. Oh, hang on. Lensworth thinks it's Wednesday. Bear with me for a sec, folks. I mean, it's Wednesday somewhere in the world. Carl right? says, The writer of the podcast I was in contacted me to do a special episode of In Between series, and we're starting recording a second season soon! Beautiful! Oh, that's awesome! That's fantastic! Nice, mate. Alright, so you're going, you're, going to, you're going to go around and look for a mine call. Yeah. My riddle something. for you, though, is what... Yeah? What's a mine without a sign? Not useful. No. <laughs> uh, I I have been remiss with that. I, because I've been less active with the mining, I, I didn't bother with the signing. With that. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, Gemma. You've only done, like, every, every fucking everything. <laughs> I think it's okay. Yeah, seriously, thank you so much for um, for the setup that you did. Like, that that just greases the ge greases the gears for this so much i can't thank you enough i i i, I think you're possibly overstating the the value of what i've actually done. <laughs> not at all no. <laughs> yeah carl said it best when he says nah nah oh. well, hello Ah, Adam's seeing new Thor on Friday. Exciting times. Yay. Yeah, I'm pretty hopeful for that. I hope that that turns out well. This is a popular area. Yeah. Iron here. Oh, baby voice actor is thrilled. I think you're underestimating yourself, Cole. That's fantastic. Freaking awesome. <gasps> Ooh, can I share something voice acting related? Oh, do, do. I... I, I did my first audition. I actually pulled my finger out and put the, the sound treatment um, in the booth and recorded my first audition since I moved the booth. Great. Nice. Oh, nice one. Yeah. It was, um... You know that moment in Mr. and Mrs. Smith where the, the other assassins are all looking at their phones and there's a moment where Vince Vaughn looks at, looks at like, the number on the contract and is like, I didn't even get out of bed for that. Yeah, it was basic, and then basically the number jumps up, and he's like, "Oh, okay," um, and moves forward. Yeah, it was a num like an audition came through, and I'm like, "I, I can't not." How did I get over Don't encumbered I so soon? Oh, yeah, that's right. I'm not alone as well. But yeah, sorry. Um, sounds like you were kicking all the ass, buddy. Well, I don't know. I mean, just getting just getting an audition out there in the world is is something, and I like it. Like that for me, basically, is those are the two things. Like, first of all, actually getting back into the habit of auditioning. I'm feeling like I I can record here, which is a huge weight off my shoulders, hmm. and then just getting back into it. How'd your MRI go, Kate? Uh, sorry, not Kate. What brain? Loose. Sorry, folks. My brain's going to be a bit scattered this, this afternoon. Loose. How did your MRI go? What? How was that experience? And his niece is in Susical in Newcastle soon. Oh, that's awesome. What What is Susical? Ooh. Tell me more. It's a Dr. Seuss musical. Oh. Sorry, I'm just going to mess with um, <laughs> video for a, again for a second, folks, because I'm getting notifications coming through 
And I don't know what the server is, but I just, I want to stop it happening. Yeah, <coughs> server. I have a feeling it might be a role-playing server that I joined recently. So this is and I haven't the muted it yet. N10 on the tip there. Notifications, only mentions, there we go. I can't believe they're doing a jukebox music. Well, actually, no, I don't know if it's a jukebox musical. They're doing a musical of Cruel Intentions. What? Yeah. <laughs> what? Uh... Oh, did you? Hey, Goose, what's up? It's not time for food yet, but if you want to come on up, you can say hi to everyone. They'd love to see you. You can be down there if you want, but yeah, it's not food time for a while. Ah, you still How you doing? Okay. How you doing, Cole? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Cruel Intentions makes perfect sense as a musical. See, I just filter everything musical-wise through Andrew, Andrew Lloyd Webber. I want to fuck my sister, is that wrong? <laughs> Probably, yes. Actually, quite very. <laughs> well, then I will take out all my twisted sexual urges on this girl who is just over there. <laughs> I, I am not entirely sure I get that reference. <laughs> well, cruel, a big a big undercurrent in Cruel Intentions is basically the, and it's not even subtext. Oh, but it's, sorry, it's the, I, I thought sexual... you were you, you were talking about Andrew Lloyd Webber as the. No, as no, the I was just <laughs> no, I was just using music of the night as that's that's like my my super easy if I'm going to hang a joke on a musical because it's such a gotcha. yeah, it's such an easy song. But yeah, yeah, there's no there's, there's no. Phantom of, the, Phantom of the Opera. That's the movie about a stalker, not the incest one. Oh, Cruel Intentions. You went to see the incest musical. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> man, I mean. I mean, it makes sense that I'm the one who watches the boys, right? Uh, we got aluminum. Don't get me wrong, aluminum. I watched a lot of the boys before I gave up. Yeah. Oh, and don't get me wrong, like, I don't think it's a it's a good or a bad choice to watch it. I was just, you know, mm. just acknowledging my general uncouthness. I reckon it might be time to head back. I reckon I'm full up. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's get some... Oh, dear. How you doing, eh? Alright, if you head back, I might just see if I can get some hunting in on the way back. Yeah, sure, sure. So, if you guys find yourselves really wanting someone to make you some uh, platinum tools, I mean, you're, you, you're welcome mm. to wander over here. <laughs> oh, that's right, you've set up base there, haven't you? Yeah, right. Yeah, I, I've, I've got a kind of cave base happening at... Um, Bottom corner, bottom left corner. Uh, sorry, bottom right corner of K thirteen. Oh, okay. And I've I've uh, gone up as high as the um, the tier four starter bench because I want my rifle. Goodness. I feel you. Especially if we're gonna go poking polar bears. Mm. Uh. Excuse me. Mm. Oh man, I only got 41 coal out of that. Boo! Boo hands! Oh, coal! I don't know what. Yes, of course. What the hell? Coal goes a pretty long way there. It does, that's true. It burns really well for everything. Oh, there's that other cave. Right, okay. Oh, where is it, Cole? There's one where I, where I am right now, if you want to have a look at the map. 
Is it on the western face? Uh, n no. Oh, it's on that little ridge, isn't it? York, yeah, because yeah, you're looking eastwards. Ridge. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Does it burn for you? Is Silence of the Lambs the musical? Wait, Cole. If Silence of the Lambs the musical is a thing, please tell me. That, please tell me that there is a song called I'll, "I'd Fuck Me." <laughs> Sorry, Gemma. I didn't mean to step on you there. Oh no, no, you're fine. Um, I, I, I was uh, throwing out a a burn for you sort of reference with a bit of bit of sledgehammer. Nice. Does it burn for you like yeah. it burns for me? Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. This cave is empty, so yeah. Get mind out. Alright. Just a so you know. uh. oh, yeah, In no. my case, it's just the talent that's empty. What? <laughs> the singing talent. Oh, nice! <laughs> a little bit more coal here. Um, oh, cool. I'm at capacity, so. I can grab some. Yeah. I, I, I can give you coordinates for a mine that has, oh, like, four or five stacks of coal if you want, but it's it's not close. <laughs> it's really not close. Ah, oh, damn. Um, at capacity, if I try to take that deer. All right. Yeah. It's like. Kevin's found found an, an, an admirable chunk of mm. the black stuff anyway. Oh, yeah. Ooh, hang on. Uh, oh, hang yeah. on. Cole, I might need, oh, hang on. Let me have a look what's in my inventory. I can mm. get rid of that stone. I don't need it. I've got... Holy ooh, shit. Song 10. So, so... Nice. Sorry, I didn't mean to step on you there, Cole. Ah, okay. So Cole has said, Song 10 in Silence of the Lambs, the musical, is I'd Fuck Me by Bill and Ensemble. <laughs> yes! Oh, uh, that makes the world a better place. <laughs> it's a fun game, actually, when you watch a film and you think, like, what moments would turn into musicals? What quotable lines would become, um, would become, like, uh, a song? <laughs> Because I, I feel like uh, Glengarry Glen Ross would absolutely have coffee as for closers. <laughs> and that'd be like a really sort of almost Chicago style. I don't know who the um, who the writer and director is, but I feel like it's a really dynamic. Thank you so much. Did you get garlic bread? Yeah. All right. Awesome. <gasps> I have the oh my hands. god, I have snack envy. Me too. <laughs> <laughs> Completely fair. Completely fair. Well, what did you want to do with all this stuff? Ooh. Time for the Eatons. Alright, I'm going to get back to base and put that deer on the spinning bench and then I'm going to wolf down some food. I am freaking starving. Uh -huh. Oh, there we go. The controller was on my pants all the time. <laughs> Horror story for the ages there. <laughs> Where's your garlic bread, Colt? If you look under your seat, you'll find your garlic bread. You what? Could, you could have garlic bread. Everyone gets a garlic bread. Oh, I forgot I need my mouse for this game. So. <laughs> That's okay, we can make that work. That deer does not look comfortable right there. It really doesn't, does it? There we go. <laughs> uh, Everyone's going to end up ordering pizza. This stream is sponsored by Domino's. That's right, two for one codes this week only. Use special discount code Space Wisconsin for a oh, 10 off. This country falls one after another. Oh, wrong sort of Domino. <laughs> um. <laughs> I had a. And if you, go ahead. I had a not beef royale from crust last night, and it was pretty magnificent. Highly recommend. Mmm. Mmm. Yeah, their meat alternatives are pretty solid. Mm. Yes. Um. 
sadly, my um, digestive system can't take very creamy stuff anymore, so like little balls of mozzarella on pizzas now are... I mean, I can have them, but I pay for it. Mmm. Uh. Uh, there next? is, um... There is the um, buffalo... It's like buffalo mozzarella alternatives. Do they ah. work any better, or is it the same deal? Probably. I'm just wondering whether or not um, Crust actually stocks them. Gotcha. I think they do. Um, oh, hang on. I might be wrong. I think there's a couple of other... Brisbane has even better um, vegan options than Melbourne, it feels like, sometimes. So there might be somewhere that actually does. Mm -hmm. That actually does do buffalo, like vegan buffalo mozzarella, because I swear there's a, there's a mob down here that does it. Mm -hmm. And I'm so sorry, Lucy, you can't get pizza delivered where you are. That sucks. That's the worst. Yeah. Uh, all right, Cole. What are we doing with um? What are we doing with basic meat? We're popping into the fireplace, or are we? Um, basic do we have meat. A... Yeah, that's that's yeah. I was actually just thinking that. Like, I'd completely forgotten how we put the kitchen together again now. Um. So. Yeah. Um. Uh, one of the other things. Cooking that station. Basic right. meat is useful if you're not aware. Mm -hmm. Is uh, biofuel. biofuel. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. Got it. I might keep it for that then because we've got a heap of. We've got to keep it cooked meat. So, we want a cooking station. Ah, oh, yeah, I can build one of those right now. Just give me a sec. Oh, too easy. Yeah, you're not wrong, Kath. There needs to be a good vegan Jarlsberg. Haven't, haven't bumped into one yet. Oh, oh actually, maybe not. Ah, oh, no, it won't take me very long to um, make a couple of ingots. Do you mind if I start making some steel coal? Oh yeah, go go. Yeah, yeah. Just give me another couple of iron ingots and then I'm set for Yeah. Um, uh, I don't think okay. Iron ingots oh shit, we've got titanium and titanium, platinum, aluminium. Oh yeah, but no steel. All right. I'm not going crazy. Yeah. Alright, I'm gonna hold the rest up. of the um, rest of the iron, like on the um, anvil. Yeah, just on the anvil would be great. Oh, hang on, I, um... Here's where all the other no, just, iron just... ingots are. Bloody hell. Okay, right. <laughs> I'm such an idiot. I should have looked. Where are they? Uh, on the, uh, on the anvil. Oh, yeah. Because Jim has been awesome. That's why. She has been. Okay, I'll put the mm. kitchen upstairs. Mmm. If it helps with the pizza jealousy for anyone, mm -hmm. this is so good. Yeah, that's that's super helpful, Kat. Well, loving your work there, mate. <laughs> Just for that, I'm going to have to go make myself some che cheese and bacon toasties. <gasps> Damn. Nice. And 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 not not vegan faken. You like bacon? The the, the the proper bacon. Yeah. Right. No, that's a okay. root of the pig. <laughs> don't need to apo don't need to apologize for not for like, you know, eating never meat. Be, never be sorry for eating what you want to eat. Hmm. Uh, okay. Now so the um so I put the cooking station upstairs. We can start making animal fat out of the uh, uh, basic meat there now. Mm -hmm. And yeah, every like all the specialty meat can go on the drying rack. Um, let me know when you want to have oh. a snooze. Oh, yeah. Yes, I can Heading do that. Back to the thing to do the the naps now. <laughs> You know, the, the, the nap place, the... The horizontal, horizontal town. Lovely. So I guess my my question for you, Carl, Sue, is what's your bar? Like, what what do you see, basically, the, um, where's your level of comfort to be able to head out and start retrieving components and stuff? Oh, right, right. Um, yeah, go for it. Any old time. Um... Yeah, 
Um, I feel a little squishy, so let's do it together. All right. Um, do you I'm need any help personally? over there, Jamalo? Sorry? Do you need any help over there? No, 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 no. I'm, I'm just um, trying to get the last few little blocks of titanium to build my rifle, and then I'll come and oh. help you guys out with uh, bipolar bears. Uh -huh. Great. Oh, yeah, no, and I told Gemma my news as well. Um, but I'll tell everybody here. Um, mm-hmm. Oh, I need a campfire. Ah, maybe. I, I've got a campfire. I just need to put some mm. fuel on it. Yeah, so um, the maybe. day after we, we streamed um, a couple of weeks ago, I got a call from the State Theatre Company. Did you go to sleep with that torch on? Mm -hmm. oh my, my god irresponsible um <clears throat> yeah uh, so i got a my nightlight it <laughs> all righty then if you if you need it then okay. mm. you got a call yeah, i got a call from the safe theater company they said oh hey um one of our guys is a little bit sick um can you come in and be a um a swing for us mm-hmm and I spent, you know, a day or two shifting stuff around to, to make um, to make room for it. But as of two Thursdays ago, I'm in the um, in the musical The Sunshine Club, which is going on at the Playhouse next week. No, this weekend, this coming weekend. Um, so I've spent the last week and a half learning dance, learning songs, learning lines. Oh, that's freaking awesome, man. Which is exhausting, but but holy crap. I honestly didn't expect to, to be in that show. I was I thought, oh, I'm just going to get to see it, and it's going to be amazing, because, you know. Thanks, Eclat. And, and now you're in it, and it'll be even more that's amazing. It. So cool, man. <laughs> oh, God. It's been, a, it's been a learning curve, I tell you what. Mmm. Um, and, yeah, that's I'm probably going to hard out at six today so that I can continue mm. working on it gotcha um, now I know you've done a lot of you've done a lot of sort of physical theater in the past um have you done much in the way of dance like what, what's your background there not much dance actually so yeah that's Ooh. been the hardest thing um so yeah I'm having to kind of oh and thank god like the technology has really kind of risen up to to meet the um kind of support that i need for for this but like they were recording every time they kind of laid down a version of a thanks cat um every time they laid down a version of a dance they'd video it and they'd put it up on up on the cloud so yeah by the time i got in they kind of went oh okay here's all this stuff on the cloud you know download what you need here's the scores and mm -hmm. pdf if you want to learn the music um you know here's some midi tracks and yeah just Ugh. I'm just oh. really impressed with the amount of stuff that they've put together. Thanks, guys. Oh, that's fantastic. Um, yeah. Uh, so yeah, I was able to like, and and you know, COVID has also attacked the the um, the, the group. So mm -hmm. we had a few days there where we, we we couldn't come in, but I just kind of spent them at home. Um, I pulled the car out of the garage and turned it into a dance studio. Um, <coughs> a car wouldn't have been. You could have left it in the garage. <laughs> I should have. Yeah, right. Um, <laughs> uh, yeah. So I just chucked the video on and just learnt the learnt the um, the dance dances uh, bit by bit um, by myself. So uh, yeah, that's been a thing. Freaking awesome. <laughs> it sounds like the good kind of not daunting but um yeah, moving right. just a little bit out of out of the comfort zone and going oh how does this how does this work let's make this happen yeah yeah and like throwing oneself into it is is, is kind of the been the order of the day <laughs> um, yeah that's a thing
I'm also doing an immersive show in August, and I had to shift around the the um, the rehearsals for that. So I'm kind of while I'm going to be doing the show, um, I'm going to be learning another show. Um, oh wow! Yeah. And so, pardon my pardon my ignorance here, but if I was to guess at when you say an immersive show, I would think of one of those things that's set up sort of over, like across rooms in a house or something like that. Yep. Yep. That sort of stuff. Oh, cool. Gotcha. Yeah. Yeah. That's... Yes, you've spoken about that in the past, Luce. I'm so... I think it was... You said it was the, um... You said it was the spine injury? That was the, um... Oh, the back nice. injury that got, in the, that got in the way of being able to do that again? I'm so sorry. God. Also, hey, in audio, to folks who have joined recently, I was busy scoffing my pizza. For those of you who are wondering, it was terrible. I regret it completely. It was mm -hmm. just disgusting. Every every mouthful was like sack... Like, uh... Ashcloth... Hang on, sackcloth and ashes, that's it. <laughs> yes, every mouthful, sackcloth and ashes. Just terrible. Oh, sorry to hear that. Yeah. It was like... It was like sack. That's right. It was like being sacked. It was like being sacked by bees. In a cloth. Not the bees! Not the bees! <laughs> <laughs> Nicholas Cage can never do the alphabet ever again. No. A! B! Not the no! bees! <laughs> Uh, already. Oh, wait. Right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna make some steel. That's right. That's what I was gonna do. Oh yeah, I dumped all the yeah, hey, stuff on, on the um, on the handle. Thank you. Hey, Circly. Hey, Machine Lord. How the heck are you? It is lovely to see you both. It's lovely to see everyone. Yeah, it was a little bit of a late start this afternoon, but it's the perfect way to end the day after a pretty, pretty busy couple of days. That's right. Hi, I'm Nicholas Cage, and I enjoy vitamin A and C, but not the bees! <laughs> <laughs> 20 epoxy, okay. Ah, uh, fuck, what am I doing? Oh, that's right, you make... <laughs> my, my brain doesn't work! Yeah, that's right, you make, you make steel in a herbalism bench, in a mortar and pestle. Ah! <laughs> uh, which kind we need to of. make. You make bloom in all words, yes. <laughs> yeah, yeah, still, still bloom. Steel bloom, the more dramatic sister of Judy Bloom. <laughs> Do we have any. Silica? Go fish. Um. Oh! Rock! Oh, damn. I thought there was a whole heap of oh, cement mixer oh, no. to come there, but no. No, there's a, there's a mortar and a pestle. Ah! It's just sitting on the fireplace. I'm going to move it. I'm going to be that guy and I'm going to move it. Mm -hmm. Which I'm now re regretting immensely. It feels like... This feels like the most pointless thing I've ever done. Because it was like right nearby and I could have just left it where it was. But there's a spot on the herbalism bench where it sits. Mm -hmm. Alright. Twenty six when you got the injury didn't get to do a lot of things after that. I mean you have you've made an incredible like you've made an incredible use of the time since. But yeah, that's I imagine that's still gotta sting pretty mm. hard. Hey, you realize when I get back to that base, I'm just gonna move it back Because uh, <laughs> I've got my own version of where things go. Oh, <laughs> is that why it's there? So you put it by the fireplace. But this, it, no, it, it, but I, I'm staring. I'm staring. <laughs> Many a true word said in jest. <laughs> By the fuck, hey, we've got like Kevin a... play Where Things Go. <laughs> yeah. Icarus the sitcom. <laughs> Mortar and pestles by the fireplace again. Gemma! <laughs> oh, gosh. <laughs> 
Do 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 do. What's this overflow doing here? Pick it all up. Put it on the thing. No. It's there for massive savings. Come down to overflow. Uh, no. Not overflow. overflow the musical. <laughs> Wait, what? What's happening? We had too much, it overflowed, and now we have more than we need. I don't know, I'm just riffing at this point. Good work. Um, no, I feel it, I feel it. There's like, work. A, work. It's like a Sinatra tune. Mm -hmm. Sinatra tune in there somewhere. And yes, we had it all, but now we don't, it's overflowed. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm I'm getting the half rhyme vibe there. Nice. <laughs> it flowed out that way. <laughs> and oh. oh, sitting full of pizza, have a beer, and plenty of water. What could be better? Well, Kath has a cat because she's, as she says, has stolen my cat. So. What that would be, be better, better than that. Whiskey and me having pizza. Ooh. <laughs> yeah. See, I like. I'd normally be with you on the whiskey, but um, after just doing like a bunch of moving stuff today, like my body was like, no, 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 Kevin. The thing we need, the thing we absolutely fucking need, is a beer. Because it, it's it's kind of it's it feels like a um a perverse contradiction, but there's nothing better I find after physical. Like doing something physical than a beer. Let's get dehydrated. Yipe, 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 yipe. <laughs> there are caves where I am trying to dig up stuff like titanium hmm. that have rather unfortunate numbers of cave worms in them yes. and they're clustered oh. in groups of four. Oh, great. That's even oh, Jesus. That's, yeah, that's spicy. Yeah. Yeah. How you doing, by the way, Magnus? How you doing? I can't remember if I asked you before. I know you said that your um, that your hindquarters are a little sore at the moment. Kate says, "Even I'd enjoy a delightful beverage after occasions like this, in which some manual labour has been employed." Ah. Why not try a refreshing beer? I enjoy a pint. Pint? No, a pint. no, no. Yes, I enjoy silly. it. I enjoy a pint or two slamming down the suds. Yeah, we've got it. That's a lot of steel. Speaking of organic, the last five years. So speaking of organic herbal steel, in the last five years, at least three different production methods have been invented that reduce CO2 emissions from steel production by as much as 90%. What? Is that what you were just reading then, Cole? Yeah. Oh, wow. In addition to having numerous other advantages in Nordic steel, and a couple of them are in the process of implementing them. Fuck, that's awesome. Hmm. Like, uh, yeah, it's, it's kind of weird, isn't it? Because I feel like, um, on one hand... It'd be nice to see, like, it'd be nice to see actual changes to lifestyle occurring out of this, but it feels like the thing that's going to save us is going to be things like that, because capitalism just continues to grind its gears. Huh. What you doing? Are you making, oh, you're making bloom, are you? Ah. You beat me to it. I just went and got injets. Ah. Fuck, fuck you. Fuck you. Steel ingots or iron ingots? Oh, I went and got iron ingots to make steel ingots. Mm. Yeah. Because you can, the recipe you can use either, to make bloom, you can use um, iron ingots as well. Oh, it, does it work out equally as well? Like as far as like, mm. if we turn it into an ingot, then, oh great. Yeah. Yeah, I, I sat down and did the math when we were in one of our first, um, when we were in one of our first prospects because I worried about the same thing. Hmm. Bones. We were like, I've you know, do if we injured, right. can we ever go back? Yep, exactly. 
Yeah, because you can, you can only inch it. You can't out it. Yeah. All right. <sighs> take your bloom. Take your bloom and fuck off. Oh, uh, no, 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 no. Uh, there. It's done. Take it. Take it and be gone, I say. I'm fuck going. Off. I'm going. I'm going. Good. Good. Fine. Oh, got it. Fine. Good. Yeah. Great. I love it. You're <sighs> <laughs> catching up. Sorry, I'm, I, I'm. I finally managed to clear out the cave worms from this cave. Mm -hmm. and it has been a thing. <laughs> oh. oh wow! Oh, Jesus not only cat. was there a pack of four, but if I stepped in an extra three feet to attack the pack of oh. four, mm. a fifth one appeared and started harassing me. No. Oh wow. Yeah, that's the worst. Because sometimes you think, oh, maybe I can just get cheeky with a knife, but no. No, no, no. Jesus, Kath, you're trying to kill me. Um, yes, okay, I will have I will have a moderate size baked good. That, would, that sounds lovely. We can just sit here. Does pizza count as a baked good? Oh. You do put it in an oven, so, you know. You do... But um no I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm gonna give a hard out on that one. Okay. Yeah. Um no la lady's choice. Lady's choice. <laughs> so son, when you say you could murder a Danish right now, I, I feel like <laughs> we need some <laughs> How close are you to Denmark? Yeah. <laughs> Closer than us. We went um, went yesterday to a bakery nearby to get some treats called La Panella, and they do um, mm. they do a vegan croissant, and we put them in the oven this morning for breakfast because we were had to get out the door pretty quick mm -hmm. um, to go do stuff, and they were like wrapped him in alfoil, just popped him in the oven, and they were really good. Oh my god! Thank you so much. Jesus Christ! I'm gonna die. You'll see it on you'll see it on stream, folks. Um, but yeah, wrapped them in alfoil and put them in the oven, and they had that when they came out. They had that really nice buttery freshness that you Ooh. get from a croissant in store. I was really surprised by that. I thought they were going to be, you know, still good, but kind of stale. Yeah, yeah. That's a heck of a word, buttery. Yeah, yeah. I know. I like, I know that you know. Yeah, they're not. It's it's yeah. It's having that sort of oily, like a good croissant is light and oily, mm -hmm. and feels yeah. Buttery is the best word for it. Great. Because there's a whole fucking ton of butter in a croissant. <laughs> <laughs> yes, moist and buttery at large. Oh, moist, eh? Mister Moist, it looks like we've got another problem here with one of our customers. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Whatever shall we do with him, Mr. Moist? Oh, I don't know. I don't know at all. Basically, because I haven't thought about it for more than a minute. I don't think much things have taxed that meat upstairs in your skull, have they? There's meat in my skull? How does it taste? <laughs> Buttery, I suppose. <laughs> I think, uh, Next week on an all new Moist and Buttery. That's the one. Pop that back. And thus we have arrived <laughs> at the silly place. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know it. Next stop, the silly place. <laughs> it is a very silly place. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, can we go to the silly place? Following the silly place, the ludicrous place, and the obnoxious place. Yeah. Braver than me, don't like anything stale. Yeah, I don't think it was stale, Luce. It wasn't that the croissants were stale, it just was that they weren't... They, they were kind of firm. It looked like they'd been cooked and they were left there. Like, I think they were baked, but not sort of left heated. 
So they were fine. They were absolutely really fine. I was quite surprised by it. It's fine. It's fine. Um, what's next then? Biofuel composter. Um. Well, this goes back to like what, like what's what's your what's your goal? What do you want to do? Because for me, I'm I'm happy to get out there and start saying hi to bears if I have a rifle. Oh yeah, right, right, okay. Yeah, sure. Yeah. But I mean, if you want to tech up, like I'm more than happy to do that too. It's just a matter of like what our goals are. Hmm. I'm happy to work towards them. Yeah. When Adam was in Orange a week ago and went to the Racine Bakery and it was so good. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, nice. God. I love a good bakery. I'm trying to think whether I went to that when I was there. Probably not. Actually, yeah. I'm partial to a chaotic good bakery. <laughs> a bakery yeah. where you never know quite what's in the pie. But you know it's going to be tasty. <laughs> and, well, and ethical, because it's chaotic good. You hope. <laughs> Lawful, no. A little bit random. Yeah. Well, well. Well, well, well. I'm using up our iron too. I'm going to go out and get more in a sec, Cole. Go on then. Oh, well, what's next then? Esky multiplayer carrot carry limits. Oh, nice. Yeah, right. We can just log out for a sec if that helps. <laughs> <laughs> Not required. Appreciated, but not required. Pineapple and bakery is pretty darn good. Oh, sweet. There you go. Adam says, one thing we don't have locally is a great bakery, which is probably a good thing given how much we find when you do find one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I went to, I was saying to Kath on the weekend, I used to go to La Panella when I was living in Preston before, quite frequently. It was years and years and years and years and years ago, to the point where. I'd kind of gotten um, a little, like, I was nonplussed by what was there because I'd had it so much it wasn't special anymore. Mm. But, um, yeah, it was a treat to go there after so long. Because, yeah, I'm with you, Adam. Like, when I go to bakeries, there is... Uh... Yeah, I'm pretty sure we did get, Kath, I'm pretty sure we got all the available vegan options in that bakery and they were not... It wasn't like that usual, that usual situation of their, like... Oh, and here's the vegan option for you. Which is, it's weird. Like, when places started getting more accommodating for vegan stuff, not to turn this into vegan hour, but suddenly there was, like, an executive decision, an executive function tax. I'm like, you, oh, my God, I've got to actually fucking choose instead of just going, I'll have the vegan option. Sometimes it's nice just to go, I know you've got something, I will have it, whatever it is. Oh, fabricator. Oh, right. Okay. That's what we've got to have for a hunting rifle. Right. Okay. So yeah, teching up is definitely a thing that needs to be done. Oh, Kate, how do you manage? Can we can we have a moment of silence for Kate? Because all Kate has nearby is just just a fabulous brownie shop. God damn. Can you imagine that struggle? How do you live? I had similar struggles last night when I got that vegan pizza from Crust and I had earned enough points for a free side and I had to spend them on brownies. Well, I guess just, just go over what it's going to be. Yeah. Yeah. Such pain. That sounds, am yeah, that sounds amazing. What's the name of the brownie shop, Kate? Are you willing to share or are you trying to, mm. you trying to shepherd them? Trying to lock us out. Hmm. Oh my god, Luce used to get all the leftover food from the local bakery on a Saturday and Sunday. That sounds amazing. Nice. 
making a bunch of twigs, by the way. I will go out and replace the wood if we run out. Brownies are so freaking good. I've got a walnut slice down here that is basically like a, a close cousin of a brownie. I feel you. Love a good brownie. Not to be confused with a brown eye. Yeah, I don't think anyone wants... No. Nah. Or, I guess, a chaotic... Chaotic good brownie? Given it's fey? So... No, that's just pure. That's just chaotic neutral. There's a, Re a Raymond D. Fy story. I can't remember what it is, but it's uh, it's not sort of in the Rift War or anything else, like world. But um, it's kind of it's um, urban realism fantasy. Now that I think about it, but yeah, it has basically this family sort of in like runs afoul of. Um, Runs afoul of the Fae. And yeah, I love basically the old myths about them. Because it's kind of like, well, we've got rules. And if you follow them, if you manage to figure out what's happening, you'll be fine. Or if you don't, you'll be fucked completely. Th thanks? <laughs> yeah, yeah. G cool? <laughs> yeah, you don't mess with the Sealy folk. No. No. That's it. Thank you. Thank you, Adam. Yeah, fairy tale. I've got a copy of it somewhere, or I used to. Bless. Thank you for that. Or rather, if you do mess with the Sealy folk, you do so at your own peril. Hmm. Yeah, I feel like you need to be like, you need to be like Constantine level. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm going to go, <gasps> go on a silica run. Adam's wife makes amazingly good brownies. As long as you're not allergic to peanuts, they have peanut butter in them. That sounds awesome. Wait, oh, come on, Kate. The, the brownies even come in a hard shape? That's that's too much. Too much. Why do you torture us so? Yes. Oh, that was what I was trying to get rid of before. Monopoly. It's gonna, this is going to be the flavor of the afternoon. I'm spending most of my time running around in circles. That's okay. <laughs> Coming, what was I about to do? I also have forgotten how to play the game. I'm just scat I'm just a little scattered in general, but in a good way. Um, fuck a duck. What am I doing? Epoxy. Eating so AFK, but listening. Gotcha. All that talk of pizza. That's completely fair. I don't know who was doing that on stream, but goddamn the inconsiderateness of that person. Oh, Jesus! H Christ. Uh, if you're a little scattered, I could uh, play play some jazzy accompaniment for you. Kevin. Oh yeah, no, that you? sounds great. Right. Uh, let's see. Etc. 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 What you making, Cole? Cement. Oh. And then I'll put a fabricator together. Oh. Shit, I need three steel ingots. Do you have any spare steel? There should be I've steel got... ingots on the in the furnace. I've got plenty in my, my troll cave. Ah. I might just have to do an iron run. Uh, a bunch of steel on the... No. Oh, bugger, sorry. I've stolen it. I need 40. But that's okay, I can go make more. Like, I don't have an exclusive right to the steel that's in, the, that's in this place. Man, give me, like, a minute and I can come join you on a run if you like. No, I'm good. I'm good, man. Is an iron run kind of like a chicken run, but fascist instead of <laughs> communist? <laughs> Yeah, welcome to the Iron Run. We used to call it Blitzkrieg, but now we call it Iron Run. Very exciting. Everyone gets like a badge at the end. You love it. It's 
very fun. Calories not the only thing we burn. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> Oof. Oof, indeed. Uh, I mean, I, look... I don't know if I get a. I don't know if I can still get the moral high ground for this, but I was going to make a joke about why they don't call it training. But Ooh, yeah. I feel like no. Let the record show that Colin, the man who does not watch the boys, went too far. <laughs> oh gosh. Ooh. Is it too early to order pizza for dinner? Is it? No, it's never too early. Okay, it's never too early. Oh, your mum worked in a in a sweet factory and let them eat as much as they wanted. Yeah, like when um when you when you, I've worked very briefly for Seven Eleven. And. Oh, actually, I think I'm about to tell a lie because I think they um. I think they had like a one slurpy per shift. It was I can't remember now. Fuck, never mind. A boy. Abort! But yeah, it's the smart choice to like let people go, yeah, you can have as much of this as you want, because then basically within a week, you just get people going, I never want to see that ever again. <laughs> As opposed to sort of the constant sort of um, nibbling away at stuff that people would do. Ah, oh, sticks, sticks. Mm hmm. Sticks. Ah, oh, you made a bunch of sticks. You're good. Ah, uh, yes, I did. Do you need more? Do you need more wood? No, no. Um, it's the epoxy that we're going to be making. Yeah, that was that was what I made the sticks for. There's yeah. ten epoxy in the machining bench. Yeah, and I made another twenty-four here, mm -hmm. so which means I need another twenty-six. I'm gonna say. Yeah, that's the problem with higher tiers. That um, time to head over to your mother's place for Sunday night family dinner. Oh, that sounds awesome. That sounds awesome, Adam. Have a wonderful time. I was gonna do. I'm not gonna do it, but I was gonna do a um, Mark Wahlberg for a minute. Tell your mother I said hi. <laughs> Tell your mom I said hi. <laughs> but yeah, have an awesome family time. Thanks for coming. Bye. Hey, donkey. So you're a donkey. That's pretty cool. I produce Entourage. Hey, chicken. We should do a film together. I'm not even joking. Tell your mother I said hi. More Corey, strings. let you know. Yeah, get him. Corey, let you know in no uncertain terms it wasn't acceptable behavior, but you got straight back on your lap. Yeah, it's too cold. It's too cold for her to hold a, to hold a grudge. So full of pizza. Not you. Mm hmm. Oh, I spent that, that extra hour watching Justified. So, how are you doing now? Where are you at? I almost finished season three, which is nice. the. Um, um, oh, good lord, what's his name? Um, it's not Limestone, it's. Um, Uh, Wyatt Duffy, I think. No. No, no. No? No. Um, oh, damn it. Uh, Sorry, uh, season three. If I said the words apple pie to you? Limehouse? 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 Oh, Lidecker. No, no, no. No? 
Yeah, you're talking. Yeah, you're talking about the um, the butcher. Yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Michael. I remember it. He's such a good actor. Oh my god. Hundred percent. That's a really interesting. Yeah, that whole thing is a really interesting plotline. Mm. And um, good old um, good old Jim Beaver has joined as a bit of a regular, instead of a one-off, one episode. Yes, I, yes. Uh, always good to see Jim Beaver and stuff because he's just he does some great work. Oh, he's fucking gold. He was one of the like, I I have a lot of love for early seasons of Supernatural, but Jim Beaver was un unquestionably one of the highlights until they killed his character. Mm, mm. Yeah. Even if he was, you know, writer's... Not so much fan service, but writer service. Um, and... Oh, um, how's... Uh, uh, how do you mean? Uh, uh, just because, um... Uh, why am I forgetting his name? Um, Eric Kripke? No, um, Bobby Singer. Yeah. Robert Singer. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, shit. Ran out of arrows. That's unfortunate. Ah! You okay? That seems like a bad thing to be in. Need some help? No, I'm good. I'm gonna just gonna make some more. I just popped outside. Okay. Um, yeah, he's an, in, he's an in joke. Yeah, yeah. Or an Easter egg, depending on how you look at it. Yeah. And, um. This is the season with, um, oh, wow. Oh, well, David Andrews is in it. He's great. Um, David Andrews, refresh my memory. Oh, um, Sheriff Tillman. Um, so, uh, Tillman and uh, so David Andrews and Jim Beaver are kind of vying for the sheriff's position in um, in the county. Oh, okay. Yeah, and it's an election. Yeah. yeah, I have a very loose memory of that. Yeah, so. Kath, yeah, Team Wolf should totally try and uh, like forge an alliance with the tentacle worms. Like, you know, see how that goes. I feel like it'd just be speciesist to not. Are you kidding? Um, just for shits and giggles, guys. Hmm. I'm not sure mm -hmm. if you're aware of this, but if you kill cave worms. And you check yep. their little pods. Hmm. Quite often, they now carry contain arrows if ah. you've shot them inside the ah. oh. inside the loot pods. Ah, right. I just did that. Thank you. Yeah, because I've just been ignoring them because they were just kind of worthless to heavy detritus. Yeah, there, there is a, um, a crafting recipe you can make. Well, a couple of crafting recipes you can make from the worm scales, and I think the worm, the poison sacks are usable later game as well. But, um, but it's it's nice to know that they've actually fixed it so you can actually retrieve your your ammunition and stuff from. It. Yeah. It's a kinder surprise. Hey kitties, come out to Icarus and kill us a worm, and then the worm leaves an egg. Or or you might well you I, I guess, yeah, you you might die too, but if you kill the worm you get an egg. Oh, that nice. Yeah. So good. Power up.
Oh, there's a lot of iron in here. Ooh. It's very cool. Nice. Right, we've got a fabricator. Okay. Yay! It's going under the stairs. Next, I now have my hunting rifle. So Love now it. all I need to do is mine a shit ton of iron so that I have ammunition for it as well. Yeah. Beautiful. I think, uh, uh, hmm? I think given the amount of resources that you've dumped on us here, Gemma, I think I'm going to be able to make at least one more hunting rifle as well. Damn. Oh. Oh, nice. Well, that was kind of the point. Yeah. Thank you. You're the bestest. Yeah. No, I'm the restest. <laughs> lies. Harsh lies. Um, yeah, Kath, another beer would be lovely if, um, and just to be super cheeky while I'm tying up stream for this, if you can grab the pizza box and pop it in the fridge, that'd be awesome. It's on the other desk. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, um, just so you know, I have um, assumed the uh, bedroll position. Um, oh, oh shit, yeah. It is after 6 p.m. in game time, and I want to duck away and make some bacon and cheese sarnies. So I will do that, and you may. Uh, you should feel no actual rush to duck back and. Stop your mining so you can sleep. Because you'll still be in the snooze gotcha. position. Indeed. <laughs> sure thing. Oh, I took Captain of snooze. I will keep my. Mm, keep busying myself. And. For epoxy. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm. If you could just grab that from over there. First lady of the You're snooze. You're the best. Thank you. Tea. Snooze will tea. Nice. Well, I oh, didn't know we were. Sorry, say again. Oh, we've acted as. Yeah, excellent. Tea well, I didn't know we were being visited by snooze will snooze will tea. <laughs> Goodness. Ah. Oh. We got an hour to go. Damn. Yeah. Where did I get my Benitos? You want someone to bring you beer and baked goods? <laughs> I mean, I highly recommend a Benitos, but I'm not sharing. <laughs> well, actually, you gotta talk. You gotta talk to Kath. Um. Brisbane is the answer. Brisbane role-playing community. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So you, you're you're perfectly placed. To get your own Benitos. There's the hunting rifle. Good error. There's enough in there. We just need a whole lot of titanium to make another one. Well, I can... Um, I think we've got some titanium... Oh, hang on. It might be platinum. We kind of do, yeah. Well, let me know when you're home. We'll have a snooze. And yeah. then we'll go hunting for that titanium and get you one. Meantime... I'll yeah, sure. I mean... Make some gunpowder. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yeah, because that way it wouldn't make it doesn't make sense to make a lower tier if it's possible to get a higher tier. Yeah. And I haven't played with one yet, so... Mm -hmm. um, it's got, like, six bullets to the mag. Um, otherwise... I think there's a is there a um, damage difference? There must be. I think there is, yeah. Oh Jesus, Luce! I'm so sorry that you're in that place of like having to wait there to find is. out whether that's going to have an impact. That's a lot.
That's good. That's okay, Luce. That's okay. I mean, I'm okay with touching on stuff briefly. I think it's just the protracted conversations that start tanking people's headspace. Oh, mate. Thank you for the consideration, all the same. Oh, uh, there's no more bonitos in Brisbane. Where to fix that? Sorry. Yeah. Teleporter, anyone? Teleporter? I... Well, actually, I, I do. <laughs> no, it's all good, Luce. It's all good. And yeah, I'm sorry that you're, sorry that you're sitting in that place. And I appreciate... Mm -hmm. I do appreciate you sharing. Yeah, it's a fine line. Like, it, you know, when things are on folks' minds, I think that there is... That it can help to share them. I think it's just those long conversations where we dwell on things or get into, si into spirals that I think are just the thing to avoid. Mm. I would love to come up to Brisbane like do a road trip with Kath and um, catch up with folks but the it's just not the world right now that I want to do it in mm. I've never been to Netherworld never been to Netherworld in Brisbane it looks fucking what? amazing oh my That's where I spent my 50th birthday. Oh, solid choice, my dude. Solid choice. Yeah. Well, the yeah. intention on the, on my 50th, like, years before it had happened, was to hire at a pinball parlor and just play some old school games. And, um... Oh, yes. Pre-pandemic, that was looking great. But no, I couldn't mm. do it. Yeah. Um, with everything else going on. So, yeah. I thought, oh, I'm just going to grab the fam and... Kind of have a sit and grab some nice vegan food and play some pinballs just with them instead. I like it. Yeah. And yes, Kate, I recognize that you want your own. Hmm. Uh, Netherworld uh, with TH. It's a it's a, a bar slash pub um, slash gaming place. I've got a bunch of arcade machines. Oh, there's a place in Newcastle that's got the same sort of vibe. I went there for a burger and it was amazing. Um, Family, I think it's called. Oh, okay. Hmm. Really uh, cool. Captain, re request permission to be that guy? Uh-oh. Granted, no, I, although I'm going to regret it. Thank, thank you. Um, yeah, I, I went to Ground Control in Portland, which is like two levels. It's either two or three levels. And it's open 24 hours and they have everything on the menu is like you can get food any time of the day and they've got vegan they've got vegan counterparts to everything mm -hmm. it was fucking amazing <laughs> like being able to put your beer being able to they had this is what makes me sad i'm not going to name them but um i ordered a an arcade cabinet um a year ago a year and a half ago now um, from a place that was that does custom cabinets, and I was in love, absolutely in fucking love with the design of what I ordered. But um, I think they were struggling with the pandemic, and they and that meant that um, like the the order just didn't go through. I never paid a dime for it. Like they they have a really smart policy, which is they said you know um, they don't take money from people until they're starting to build a machine. But I never heard back from them, so I'm guessing they like don't know how to. They, they, they were struggling with the pandemic. But um, one of the things that I got on the custom build was those little cages for the beers on the side and ground control. Like, every machine, like, has them. So just being able to be somewhere at, like, 1 a.m. in the morning and mm -hmm. just, you know, pop your beer in the machine and play some old-ass, like, arcade cabinet that you've got fond memories of from being a kid. Because um, arcades, I don't know if you remember, Cole, but they were just dying out when we were around... Um, uni age or a little bit a little bit older mm -hmm. yeah because that was yeah that was the point when everything was transitioning to being like time zones it was amusement parlors because consoles were kind of the death knell for arcades 
Yeah. But um, yeah, I still remember like being sort of a uh, like being really young and you know twenty cent arcades having just the most fucking incredible range of machines. Yeah. With a whole bunch, yeah, a whole bunch of stuff going on. That was great. Been to Netherworld, but it's too loud. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that, Kate. Oh, yeah, right. yeah. Earplugs, earplugs sound like a really good choice there. Like that sounds like that would really help with that. The same way that a concert can be too much. Yeah, and I think you're absolutely right. I think you're absolutely right, um, Kath. It's, it could have been problems with getting components because anything to do with um, chips at the moment or or processors. Like fuck, car production has been slowed down because it's so hard to get it's so hard to get computer components. Mm. And yeah, I'm sorry to hear that, Luz. That your family doesn't actually understand. That sucks. Um, so, Cole, with this with this uh, hunting rifle, uh, what do we need? Um, titanium. Yeah, yeah. Let me know when you're ready. Do you to have go. the? Oh. oh, it's oh, it's in the fabricator. There we go. Let's awesome. have a look. See. Yeah. Titanium ingots. Just grab a bit more sulfur because we're going to need the bullets. What have we got? We've got two titanium ingots at the moment. Alright, so we... Yeah, we need to get a fair chunk of titanium then. Okay. I'm for it. I'm for it. Need that for the bears. The phone vibrating wakes you up in the morning. Oh, wow. Yeah, that's... Good, but yeah, sensitive at the same time. I'm at a stage at the moment where it's 50-50. I have mornings where, um, if Kath is staying here, like, poor Corey, she would not get fed if I was the only person there because I'm just oblivious to the noise she's making. <laughs> no. I think that is winter territory up there, so I'm not going to go that far. When terraforming went south, oh. the temperature up what? here didn't just drop, it went in a free fall. It's a completely different world now. Weather never recovered, it's just one big rolling storm. Lagos and Group 15 think their new tech can do something about that. But expect the unexpected, because no one's sure what the hell's happening in the Arctic yet. And that's why you're here. That was me Didn't... wandering into oh, okay. snow by like a foot or so. Oh, Sorry. okay. <clears throat> no, that's all good. I was just wondering what was happening. Yeah. So, it wasn't quite far enough to make it dangerous for me, but uh, Sol just decided to say something anyway. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sorry about that, Kath. If it's any consolation, I was the same. I woke up at like five in the morning, briefly. Yeah, that anxiety of having to be somewhere at a point in time. I feel you. Alright, buddy, I'm going to go back north and I'm going to see if I can find some uh, titanium in that mine. Oh, hang on. Oh, fuck. No, first I'm going to make a uh, steel pickaxe. Otherwise, I'm just going to stand there and stare at the titanium and go... It would be really nice to be able to mine that. Hmm. Uh, spin yeah, she's for a little bit more um, uh, sulfur, but um, can't find any. Um, oh, by God, I think there's some on the way to the mine. I'll keep an eye out unless right. we've oh, gotten everything. You on your way? Not yet. I'm I'm making the um, the iron pickaxe first. Oh, sorry, the steel pickaxe come back and bring what I've got then. And, um, All right. Also a deer that was glitching. Oh, shit. Actually, I'm probably not going to be able to make it if we all of our sulfur is gone. Coming back with some, yeah. Excuse me. Okay, cool. Thank you. A little bit. All I could find. Just kind of wandering around. Uh, oh, no. Hang on. I think I've got enough to make. No, no. Oh, it's, it's just tree sap I'm missing for epoxy. It's all good. Ah. Oh, 
Ah, coconut macaroon. Nom 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 nom. Enjoy it. Hmm. And yeah, I see you sleeping uh, on the cards for tomorrow morning. Cap. Not that way. Okay. <laughs> so, I'm back. Nice. Um, just thought I might share a little bit of a... A, um, a lefty piece of news. Mm -hmm. um, in uh, Ecuador, they had a general strike for 18 days mm -hmm. and the government has come to the table uh, uh, with a commitment to reduce the amount of oil they're mining significantly like by like 80 percent or something like that mm -hmm. uh, they are going to stop all exploration for new sources of oil they're going to uh, do a bunch of um, stuff to retrain the uh, population or percentage of it that is involved in the oil industry they're doing a whole heap of stuff to uh, come to the table and be good environmental citizens and oh. all thanks to an 18, uh, 18 day general strike oh and that's fucking show, incredible just goes to show that if you're willing and you are willing to actually band together and do the thing you can actually get shit done yeah yeah Sometimes it actually works. Yep. The people united indeed, Kay. So I have my coffee, I have my freshly topped up drink. Mm -hmm. I do not yet have my um uh, my what you call it? bacon and cheese toast. Sanger? Yep. Because they are still toasting. Ah. But that is, as they say, a minor obstacle. Mm. Oh, damn it! What's up? Wolves, wolves everywhere. Oh yeah, there was a sale. Oh. Sorry, I um, I kind of just kept clicking. That explains everything. Hmm. I just want to take this damn deer home. Is that too much to ask? And I accidentally skinned it. Oh well. Didn't mean to do that. Oh. I'm so glad that you're able to chill in your own space now, Luce, as well. Now that your family's gone. I, I hate to do this to you, Cole, but... Hmm. Oh dear. <laughs> Had to be done. Oh! <laughs> Go! There's another one coming up to the house. Would you... Would you just get out of here? Oh, Will's trying to eat the house again. Uh, that was dear that time. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I tried to explain to my daughter the other day um, the true horror behind um, gingerbread houses and gingerbread people. <laughs> <laughs> I love that cartoon so much. It's cruel. I never thought about it until I. <laughs> right? <laughs> Oh, and did, so, like, do you want me to sell the sulfur for anything in particular, or just more gunpowder? No, I know I had enough to make epoxy, so I'm good. Okay. Right. Yeah, thank so, you for asking that. And go ahead. Yeah, that's all good. Yeah, and so she, and so she basically, like, I was talking about sort of having a house made of flesh, and she was like, "Oh yeah, so we'd have like hair on the roof." I thought, yeah, that would be that would look really fucking creepy. Thatch. Right. Mm-hmm. Almost went past. 
Is that hair on your roof, or are you just really horrified? <laughs> <laughs> little Sadako house has, like, really long hair. What are you? What are you? Copper. That's right. And you? Uh, probably gold? Yeah, gold ore. Uh, bugger, there's no... Yeah, there's no titanium here. There's aluminium, but no titanium. Check the master list that Gemma made then. No. Uh, yeah. Whereabouts are you guys I'm back mining at, at the moment? Oh, I'm back at home. Uh, I'm up in N10. M10? Don't N10. N for uh, Nevada. Hmm. Oh, how non NATO of you. <laughs> uh, I don't think I mined much, if anything, from there. That might have been where I pulled some titanium from, though. Um, and, and if the entrance was open yeah. uh, with a kind of J-shape carved in the rock, yeah. that would be how you would know that I've been there. Yeah. It was. Uh -huh. Um, J15 looks like it's where, where it's at for titanium on your list, unless you've cleared it out already. I have cleared it out already. All right. And should we have a look at the, um, the, the uncleared ones on the list? Yeah. Okay. Um, the, the ones in the J area, I'm kind of huh. clearing out because ah, yeah. they're kind of past the point where you need to go back into the no to finish off the, the rest of the mm. quest but all right can we steal some titanium then yeah no, no 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 that titanium's all there for you guys i've actually created my rifle i'm tickety boo all set to go i've got platinum um mm. uh tools so nice. okay where, where would we head then to grab some titanium uh pick a mine any mine any mine at all there's no specific good place for any of the minerals. Oh, there's sorry, always, I got. I there's got a random. I thought... Go ahead. Uh, that any given node has a random chance of being a particular type of node. I understood. I got confused. I thought you were just saying that you'd mined out the titanium. Um, so that's my bad. I misunderstood. All right. So I'll. It sounds like then if I just keep curving around, basically. This, um, if I could keep curving around this rock formation and start heading um, down to um, M, Mickey 11 and Mickey 12 then I might find something <laughs> or, am, or am I missing the point completely I'm not 100% sure okay sorry what uh, I, I was in combat what was the you right? uh, what was the point you were Potentially missing, not missing, or otherwise. Yeah, I was just saying. I thought you were saying before that you had cleared out the titanium no titanium mines, but I might have uh, misunderstood. Uh, from uh, uh, from the there are a handful of places where I have done some titanium mining. Oh, okay, cool, cool. All right, cool. I'll just keep looking. But uh, for the most part, those ones I have noted on uh, in the Discord. Gotcha. Carl Kath says, "Stop trying to make thatch happen." <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> oh. Um, do you want me to come and help you out? Uh, yeah, sure, sure. Right, I will just oxy up and then. Uh, come Hang on, out. what are you doing, game? Oh, uh, that's why. Sorry, folks. I'll fix that video back up as well. Mm -hmm. There we go. Okay. 
leave some stuff behind. Oh, actually. <laughs> oh, how'd you go with the um, PlayStation repairs, Liz? I remember you talking about them last time. Uh, last time we were around. Were they successful with the SSD? Did you want any um, silica, by the way, Cole? Were you trying to um, get oh, more of that at the moment? No, I'm good, thanks. Okay. Oh, hello. You mm -hmm. look pretty. Thank you. Wait. Oh, now it's all good. Oh, I'm glad that that, yeah, I'm glad that fix bought you some time with that. Boost, that's awesome. I'd be completely at sea doing something like that, so you got one up on me there. Alright, what's going on here? Just wood then. Okay. Cool. Oh, thank you. Hmm, Kath? Come back. I have something for you, Kath. <gasps> Gone. Return. Return. I love houses that have, um, that have eccentricities. Ah, there we go. Fucking titanium. Ooh. 100%. It's happening. Let me know if you need some help collecting or carrying. Yeah, we'll do. Yeah, if you want to come over to this mine, there's a bunch of useful stuff here. Yeah, cool. I um, am... Empty out my pockets go ahead. and I'm, I'll, I'll come there. Yeah, Mickey Ten, Eastern Face, just um, just right above the um, the grid reference going into Mickey Eleven. I see you. Okay. Uh, that gonna... might have been that might have been the only titanium node, oh. but there's other useful stuff. Oh no, there's a, yeah, there's another one, and there's other useful stuff. There's copper, mm -hmm. which you're gonna want if you're heading into Tier Four Tech. Mm. They've actually made it so much easier than a Mac would be. Oh, that's really good. Horizon Zero Dawn still is so expensive. Yeah, um, Forbidden West. It is, yeah. I gotta say, I don't know that I would recommend purchasing that game, either. Interim games. In recommendations for interim games that might appease your ADHD brain. Oh, that's a tricky one. Mm-hmm. Ghost of Tsushima. Yeah, go ahead. Uh, I was just going to say, it kind of depends on which type of ADHD 
you have as well though, because if it's hyperactive then yeah, like Ghost of Tsushima or um you know, any of the Well, I can give a few recommendations based on games that loose well not recommendations, but like to give you an idea, like Loose has really gone, has really jammed on Fallout 4, uh, Subnautica. So they're like they're two games that have really, really fit um, her playstyle. Uh, how about No Man's Sky? Ooh. Yeah, I think. Um, oh, there we go. Inattentive, a inattentive ADHD. Okay, inattentive. Um. Tends to be captured by the attention of inattentive ADHD. Tends to be captured by things where there are opportunities to be creative, in particular. Hmm. Um. So I I I have inattentive as well, and I I really vibe with. Um, Crafter Builder games, um, City Skyline sometimes. Oh yeah, Although, yeah. There's saying, um, go ahead. I don't think it's right, but but survival games in general, um, I find quite capture my um, attention quite well. Gotcha. Yeah, City Skylines. I've been meaning to check out the. Um, there's an Xbox port of that that's popped up on Game Pass that I'm really oh, curious cool. about. ready to believe anyway. Gotcha. What, sir, have you been doing? I'm trying to clear my pockets out. I love it. It's too good. doing there. Good lord. I hate to say this, Cole, but I'm going to be coming back by the time you leave. <laughs> Jesus. Well, is there anything there that needs carrying on mining? Uh, it's a good note. There's good stuff. There's copper, there's gold, there's iron. Okay. It'd be worth, it'd be worth, um, like, farming it. Alright. I'm away. Cool. Even though it's 2pm... By the time I get out there, it'll probably be nap time. Just bring a jello cup. Ah, oh, cooking something. That's a good idea. <laughs> Fuck it. No way. Oh, man. It's too good. Yeah. I was I, I was going to get there, but then I had to, I had to make a snack. Yeah. <laughs> it grew, though. Speaking of then, snacks, and then, my toasties are probably almost ready. Get them. Yes. Get that sweet, toasty action. All right. Heading home. Okay. Pass you on the oh, way, Oh, City think. Skyline. Sorry, go ahead. We'll pass you on the way, I think. Yeah. Yeah, you will. Uh, yeah, it might be. Go ahead. Oh, no. I, I was just going to say if uh, if Luce has ever played uh, SimCity, um, City Skylines is kind of the spiritual successor for it. And it has modes as well from memory that are more just kind of like fuck around and make your city. Is that right? Uh, or is it, is it more that it's city building is a little more simple? Uh, no, it's city building is actually quite a bit more complex. Oh, okay. Um, there you go. Uh, it's, it's actually pretty similar, but it's, there's a lot more depth to it, which will capture your attention. Yeah. If that helps. Excellent. 
Yeah, I'm I'm with you. Like I'm like I I loved SimCity, Luce. I was so disappointed by um fuck, it wasn't two thousand. What was the real dud SimCity with the really small city sizes? It's basically the last one that they released in the franchise, if I remember correctly. And it was just it was really disappointing. It launched it was a, a half an undercooked launch. Sorts of games do do click with you, and you just love. Gotcha. Yeah, Gemma's insights incredible. I wouldn't go that far. That said, well, I, I do. I mean, like, it's useful. Hmm? I, I I also like the the action games like Battlefield and um, Fortnite. As as much as a lot of people like to heap shit on Fortnite, it's um. It's actually good fun. Oh, do people... That feels like it's a silly thing to do. Like, why do people heap shit on Fortnite? Um, a lot of people see it as kind of a kid's game. Huh. Yeah, I can see that. I mean, there's definitely a high skill ceiling in terms of entry, and there is... There is a, um... Not a reliance, but definitely your Twitch reflex carries you a long way. But it, feel, it feels like like if you're going to bag on a game, I suppose commercial success isn't always, you know, isn't always a um, a, a uh, indication of quality. But that game, that game is fucking bankrolling Unreal. <laughs> like it's bankrolling Epic Games. That is their that is their Valve storefront. They have found the thing that is just giving them bags of cash. Oh, weird. It's titanium outside yeah. here. Oh, did I miss that? Maybe. Nice work. Nice work. And was it on the mine? Was it on the south side or the north side of that ridge? Uh, it was on the. It was on the. Uh, well, east side, I guess. You know, you'd have to be facing east to see it. Oh, right. It wasn't on the ridge. It was on the actual. It was on the main rock formation. I haven't been. I've been lazy and I haven't oh. been checking out the the ridges. Right, right, so right. So it's on the it, yeah, yeah. It's on the main mountain. Yeah, yeah. Because there's definitely a um, like on the on that ridge line where you were, mm -hmm. um, on the north side of it is where I just spotted all this titanium. So um, oh wow, okay. Uh, oh jeez, I just have to kill some things, I guess. I'll be back. Or not? They're, nobody's gonna pop out at me. Okay, fine, fine. I'm just going to take your rocks. See if I care. See, uh, I'm confusing myself now with my threats. Sorry. Well, they're, they're my rocks now. Cold. Yes. So, uh, so, so Soakley says, Soakley says thought most of the, the hate for Fortnite was because of the fan base. I mean, it could be because gamers are the actual worst. But... Or a certain class of them. I mean, and, and look, honestly, in voice chat, you're going to get a bunch of shrieking kids going, You're such a meme, why don't you do this? Why you... And, hmm. yeah, that exists, but you don't have to turn on voice chat, right? Yeah. Yeah, but you can also get, um, depending on the game, I guess it also depends if, if you're squatting up with randoms, that can be a real crapshoot as well. Yeah, and if you... It, I mostly play solos, so I don't have to worry about any of it. No, oh, okay, there you go. The no... Oh, there's a no building mode in Fortnite. Huh. Yeah, that's kind of new. Which is, And it's, it actually kind of makes the game a bit interesting, to be honest. Mm hmm. Particularly for those of us who... Um, are not really, like into that really super quick twitch build spamming bullshit yeah because i've watched videos of people doing people like in fortnite and i you could slow that video down and i, I would i would still probably not understand what, what's happening i mean it's a fun game like oh yeah i mean play itself is is loads of fun yeah, no, don't get me wrong, I'm not disparaging it at all. It's uh, It was more sort of a self-deprecating 
um, like attempted a gag about the fact that in build mode, it, what what is happening is happening so fucking fast. It can, yeah. Although mm. normally it's only end game where people really go overboard with it. So yeah. Wish you could search for games using inattentive ADHD. Yeah, it feels like that. Like that's a someone should put together a website that has or like a Steam curator. Mm. Feels like there's a gap there for neurodiversity. Yeah, that'd be so yeah. cool. <laughs> Played the mobile version for a bit. They made it PVP. Is that um? Hang on, is that the mobile version of SimCity or the mobile version of Fortnite? Must be thinking of SimCity, then, maybe. Ball guys for a good while. Yeah! Is that still around and things happening? Uh, yeah, they've developed heaps of new maps for it. Oh, fantastic. Hmm. Because, um, yeah, that was, that was, that felt like that was a real, that was a real pandemic success story. Because that was, that was the game that fucking everyone was playing at a point in time. I think I'm full up. Oh damn, missed that call. Alright. Come back after the storm. The bait. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> oh, hang on. Oh, there we go. I was worried for a second there. I... I thought all of my titanium mining was going to get three ingots, but no, there's more to come. No communication with any other players. Yeah, 100%. Because any communication mechanism, like, uh, Hearthstone, I think has shown that, you know, you can give people any kind of, uh, communication mechanism as innocuous as you want, and people will find a way to make it annoying and abrasive. What if I spam emotes at you? What if you don't? <laughs> you could not. Oh, what was the emote they had to change, Circly, on her stone? I'd, I'd never heard that before. Got four guys on PS Plus when it dropped. Nice! <coughs> yeah, it feels like that's a really good candidate for um for becoming free to play with cosmetic as cosmetics as their um their economy. Doop 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 well this titanium is kind of ticking away. I might head back up to the mine again. Okay. Oh it is just before six, so you might want to bed. Oh uh, it is, yeah. Yeah, uh, I'll come and dump my stuff and then um. Sorry was changed to WoW. So when you say they had to change one, why was Sorry changed? Were people abuse somehow abusing Sorry as an emote? Oh, you're right. It is dinner time. It is, isn't it? Okay. Um, I'm going to be back in a sec. I'm just going to go feed the, uh, the Ferrari one. I'm going to leave the stream running, folks. God, that sounds like a metaphor. You're a bad man. Oh yeah. Oh, I should take my headphones off too. That would help. Go on then. <laughs> <laughs> oh my. I spotted around here like a deep sulfur vein somewhere. Okay. 
<laughs> Is that your cave down there, Gemma, in the mountain pass? Uh, sorry, yeah, the uh, the one at the bottom of cave 13, bottom yeah, right. right. Yeah. Gosh. <laughs> Is it cosy? Uh, yes, yes, I've actually gone and set up a dehumidifier now, so it's oh, quite comfortable. One would have to imagine. <laughs> uh, it is past 1800 hours in game yeah hopefully Kev put himself in bed but maybe not he has not <clears throat> Ugh. No. hopefully then it'll give me enough time to empty my pockets and then I can get on with the thing Someone, no, you've got to take it away. Okay. Hello. 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 Welcome back. Another instance of it's Kevin again. Hmm? <laughs> it's Kevin again. Hallelujah. The sitcom. The sequel, the series. Look, I've been telling you, I've been telling you, Chief. Someone's been killing people in the suburb. You've just been, you know, burying them out the back of their yards. It's Kevin again. <laughs> well, that took a duck. <laughs> Turn to the left. <laughs> Look, sometimes if you want to raise a family right, you need to speak some Latin, okay? Uh huh. We we were just commenting on the fact that you hadn't left your character queued up for sleep if. Oh, I'm the worst. I'm the absolute worst. <laughs> Sorry, it's sleepy times, isn't it? All right, I'm going to go upstairs and sleep. Me too, me too. Oh, actually, I'll switch this fire Carl's, on. Carl's got a rifle. I'm feeling intimidated. Get in bed. Get in bed! <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now get up! <laughs> time to well, wake up. Comb to your hair. Summer camp is, is a lot less fun than I thought it would be. <laughs> uh, now, how are we going with this rifle? Uh... Yeah, exactly. Exactly, Luce. Here's Kevin! 30 ingots to go. Oh, actually, let me pull that copper out so that it does titanium first. Hmm. Because, mm. yeah, uh, we need, what was it, 40? Yeah, and we've got nine. All right. Well, math being an important skill. Hmm. We're going to need more titanium. Yeah, I just bumped, uh, just chucked a lot on the furnace. Oh, you're the best. Oh, yeah. Yeah. What's there to be eaten? There's a bunch of meat. Nice. Oh yeah, no, that should do it. Yeah. That should do... Hang on. 40. Mm -hmm. right. No, next? we're gonna need more. We're gonna need more titanium. Ugh. All right. Twenty-five. Hours. Was there more? Oh, yeah, right. Okay. Was was there more on that ridge? No, there wasn't. Yeah. All right. Well, I head north. Oh. I head north, north regardless, in search of titaniums. You going there now? Yeah. All right. Come join you. Oh, hang on. Wait, shit. No, I'm going to drop off the iron ore I've got in my pockets. That would have been silly. That's a good. Idea. I was about. I was Ooh. about in an ill-advised moment to uh, satirize. The delay that it, in your leaving the house. Mm -hmm. Shortly before having to come back in and empty my own pockets, this would have been a misstep. Double take. 
do you need a canteen? No, I've got one. You good? Thank you. Oh, that's right. That one's spare now. Okay. Yeah. I'll put that in here. My pockets are empty. And this spoiled plants can go in the box as well. No, Aww. it can go in the mortar and pestle. <gasps> Speaking of plants, mm -hmm. I bought I bought some a bouquet of three flowers uh, a fortnight ago from a florist because uh, I I went to the dentist and I I got my regular checkup and there was a florist there and I thought oh. I've been meaning to I've been meaning to get some flowers to just spruce the place up a little bit and add a little bit of light, mm -hmm. um, and it'd be really nice to get some. And there's a florist right there. I'll go and do that because Kath very kindly let me have her like vodka, rainbow vodka skull bottle. It looks really cool. Uh -huh. um, it, it makes a great vase. And so I got these three flowers like two weeks ago. And I asked at the time I asked for extra plant food like the sachets of stuff that florists um, will often give you like one of with. Um, flowers and so she very kindly gave me three of them and they've been they have not begun to wilt yet oh cool and i've still got a sachet of the plant food left it's really awesome now which way are you going ah up that ridge Nice. i was just yeah i was just checking out the ridge along the way i could have joined you Oh no! Oh no, Luce, I feel you. Yeah. Did that thing where your eyes were bigger than your belly, and after not eating all day and hearing talk of pizza and garlic bread, you ate twice what you ha would have for lunch. Oh, no. And now you're now you're feeling it. That is not a good feeling. Yeah, if it's any consolation, after a couple of beers and half a pizza. There's my guy. I, uh... Hey you! I'm definitely ready for a nap post stream. <laughs> Wait, I said the the D word. Sorry, hang on. You have to remind me. What was the D? What what was the D word? Nap. No wait. That's Nap. not how you spell D. No. No. No, that's not how you spell D. <laughs> <laughs> how does one spell D? What is D? D how do you e define D? E. <laughs> Dinner. Mm. E. Is that, is that e. it? <laughs> oh, sorry, yes, of course. Yeah, that word, yes. Yeah, fuck, after all of your trials. Jesus Christ. Oh, I should have made some signs before we left. That sort of been a good idea. That yeah, how are we going to know otherwise if there aren't signs? And then that's the thing. Well, ask Gemma, because Gemma knows everything. <laughs> That's a delicious mama and a chunky. Just like me. Mmm, mmm. The Domeo grin. <gasps> okay, so this one we've cleared out? Is that right? Yeah, yeah. We did. We did indeed. Yeah, your dentist is the fucking worst, Kath. I'm so sorry that you had the experiences you had, but I'm glad that you're on the other side of them. Yeah, no, no one wants, no one wants anyone to give to give them that D. Mm -hmm. Nope. Vitamin dentist. <laughs> no, no, fucking no. I know I said it was only not the bees. No, not the dentists either. So, uh, I'm going to head round to you guys. Oh, okay. Spicy. Okay. Let's do it. Three will be company. Yeah. Oh, do we need more? Yeah, let's get it. Yeah. Fuck you, Sulfur. Fuck you.
Um, just so you know, the whole point of me setting up that um, area in the mine mm -hmm. that I've been in um, is so that there's a staging point for setting up a proper base uh -huh. uh, over at the mouth to that... Um, Madness? Uh, to that <laughs> snow area where the second and third components are and where you need to do the scanning. Oh, okay. oh thank you for doing that. Spasiba. Um, Spasiba. But, you know, I've, I've left it up, left it, like, it's, it's, it's got everything, it's got a heap of supplies in terms of materials and, you know, mined goods and so on, but it also has a bunch of ventures that you can either pick up and move or make what you need to create what's necessary for that base. Mm. Beautiful. Didn't want to do it all for you. No, I appreciate that. Thank you. Yeah. As my Russian compatriots say, space bar. Space bear. Space bear. Space bear. Bear is in space. Bear is in space. Bear is in space. What you doing out there, man? Uh, Perestroika. Uh, 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 <laughs> Minsk. I mean, Minsk. I actually, no, that's Ukrainian, isn't it? <laughs> oh, yeah. Glasnost. Oh. Glasnost, indeed. Might as well just grab the gold while I'm here. Fuck it. Did Cole just make Dol Dolmio into a euphemism? I feel like the question you wearing about wearing the Dolmio grin is a euphemism to begin with. That's the ghost. Nothing else, eh? <gasps> Kate got dinner and dessert. Yeah, I think that's everything, sir. Okay, clear this one out. Yep. Cool. Um, What's for dinner, Kate? What's for dinner? Oh, I'm about to hit level 47. Great. Nice. I've got about 50 something odd kilos of space left, so. Yeah. yeah. Well, I got 50 kilos of space in my pack. Kevin. Yep. Ooh, there's. Ooh, more sulfur. Um, your light's still on. Oh, that's embarrassing. Better zip it up. Yeah. Well, the stream was still running, so I thought it's against terms and services. Yeah. Mm. Right, so Hadn't yeah. considered that. No. Where are you going? Hawaiian pizza. What's for dessert? What's for dessert? We need to know. Oh, hmm. well, there you are. Yes, Brad. There he goes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Mine hunt only, okay. Oh, oh, so good. Yeah, it's gotta be said, Dol like Dolmio's vegan options are a good solid staple. I'm really surprised by I don't know if it's that my constitution has improved or their pizzas have gotten better. But when I was traveling for work, like Domino's used to be the only thing that you could get. Um that was that was vegan that was easy like you know if you're as per like most of the time when you when you're doing hey how yeah. you doing hello hello oh what's that fancy thing you got on your back right oh. uh yeah this is the the scanner do hickey thing nice oh nice the radar by okay. a few radar we're following you oh well, uh, are we okay wait or we are or we are i was gonna follow you guys back to base <laughs> okay I just set a waypoint. Oh, okay. I'm I'm out looking for platinum at the moment. Oh, I did set a waypoint. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. All right. Uh, sorry. I'm heading. I'm heading east. I was going to go grab more platinum because I still need more. That way. Okay. I mean, I'm happy to. I'm happy to take a stab at this being underpowered. But if I like, mm -hmm. I kind. I kind of want the same neat. The same neato potato. Uh, tier four rifle that you all are going to rock out with. There he is. Sorry, yeah. Um, but yeah, if you want to head back to base, like, I'm happy just to wander around and, and see if I can find stuff and I can come back later. Oh, well, there's what? 
you know, seven, eight hours left in the day, you might as well keep on going with you. Give you a hand. Um, do you have a, uh, a cave detector? No. No, I don't. Uh, no. So. I do not. I found a cave, though. Hey! Ooh, this looks like it's got a little minerals in it. Let's um, give it, it a shot. It does. Oh, it might have some cheese too, Cole. Nice. Oh, hello. Oh, oh. Ooh. Ah, fuck it. Yeah, how about I um shoot those motherfuckers? I might need a resin a sec. Because I didn't bring any food or herbals with me. Okay, keep an eye on I'm travelling light. Three, two, one. Corey's forgiven you twice for getting up. Oh, but he's back okay. in your lap. Yep, All I'm right, doing okay. So, titanium. Oh, that's iron. I thought it was sulfur. Oh, for heck's sake. Do either of you have any sulfur hand? Yeah, I do. Yeah, yeah. Um, cool. Let's dump some I of your feet. I just need eight for a... Oh. Right now? Here we go. Uh, ideally. Yep. Because uh, I don't have a torch. Yep. And inventory and drop. Beautiful. Yeah. Thank you. Sure, sure. Oh yeah, uh, Got so... platinum, but no no titanium, sadly. Oh, for God's sake. Boo. Alright, let's get going. Yeah. Oh, hang on. Oh, wait, wait. There we go. Oh. Uh, maybe there's more then. Um... Do -do 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 -do. There's coal here. Mm. Yeah, there's, there's coal and a lot of iron. These smaller caves tend to have fewer nodes, which means the percentage chance that they'll have a um, a titanium node is relatively low. Gotcha. Um, like I said, the the percentage chance that any given node will be a particular mineral is fixed. Okay. Um, the hmm. So the more nodes, the more chances you have to, to make that dice roll, if you like. The more chances you have to win. And sometimes, even after you've mined all the visible parts of the node, there's still stuff... Oh, really? ...going around. Yeah, you just have to be kind of... This is why I'm kind of having a close examine of the floor here. Uh, pixel hunting. Hmm. As soon as it clicks over and says that there's... Because I didn't hear a kind of node-finished kind of sound on that titanium, oh. so... Ah! I think I've got it. Wait. Uh, that's not quite it. Can't see the rest of it. No. That's okay. I got seven out of it. So. Nice. Okay. I've got room for another twenty-two kilos. Might as well just get some coal, I guess. Oh, hang on. Iron. Iron. I'm just going to head a little further south, see if we can find another cave. Um, before you do that, Kev. Yep. Wand back to cave map. Yep.
Oh, thank you. Do you have a spare? A little easier. That is the spare. Well, no, that, oh, okay. that, that that's the one I've been using, but I know where the, where the things all are because I've found that map on the internet. Oh, okay, cool. Thank you. I appreciate that. It has all of the the mines in the area. Well, in fact, all the mines on all the maps are mapped on that. Come with you and give you some Oh, cover. okay. Okay, awesome. Excuse me. Shammer. Still too close to that other cave. Yeah. Yeah, they'll be really useful once we can make a car. Hmm. Wipe down that windscreen like there's no trouble at all. Right? Wolf. Your light's still on. I love how the cave scanner is just a bunch of like components slapped together in just the most ramshackle thing. It's really slapdash, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> If you want something that works, you can have my cave scanner. If you want something pretty, you can make your own. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I mean, I've made a cave scanner that looks exactly the same. Spicy times ahead. Excitement. Hang on, what are you saying? Is it beeping uh, like there's something around here? I thought so, but it, it must still must just be proximity or like um, relative proximity because I thought there was a. Yeah, it's going nuts around here. Okay. Mm -hmm. But nothing. Map. Uh, I don't know where there... it could possibly be, Cap. Yeah, there's no ridges around here. Yeah, it can only be the mountain face. Hello. Oh. Okay. A mine, they call it. <laughs> oh, God. I am, like, full up, so if I start... If I start digging, I'll just, like, get overweight straight away, so... No stress. Um, just the cover... Like, the, um, the additional bow for... Or fire for uh, opening it up would be good. Yep. I'll um, have a look at my uh, my little talent tree here because I just went I got to level forty seven just now so. Um, Sweet. You hey, cheeky sod, Gemma. You were just standing right outside the doors to Moria, going, "No idea." All <laughs> 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 mm -hmm. right. Oh. oh, you've already found a way. You've got a way in. Okay. Damn, Finn. Oh, Jesus, sorry. Ow. Oh, oh fuck. He just, like, chose the wrong moment. Oh, no, he's so sorry. I mean, to be fair, you never know when a, a fellow miner is going to turn on you. Nice. And I did turn to the left, so... Clearly my own fault. Oh wow. That'll do it. Blimey. Hmm. Still dying from the poison. Ah. 
You okay? Uh, oh no, I've run out. All good. So nice big cave. That's yeah, titanium up there. I was just pushing in to see if there was yeah. anyone else who wanted to play. That's titanium right here. Right in front of me. <gasps> so yeah. Where? you can collect. So just here. Alright. Do let there be luck. around for the rest. Oh. Uh, if anyone has any um, coal, feel free to stick it in these things that I'm sticking down. Uh, let me see. Uh. Oh. oh, yes, I do. Okay. Oh, no, I thought I did, but I don't. No. Let me hang on, but I can do this. Uh. How is the pizza? We must know more. Is what? Is this a silica deep deep mining deposit? Not a hundred percent sure. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. It looks kind of like it looks kind of like silver, but that's not a thing, is it? No. I don't think uh, silver's a thing in this game. Another titanium node here. <sighs> Thank you. You can normally tell a, a tell a mine that I've been in because there might still be a few of these light sticks hanging about. Mm -hmm. Gotcha. All right. What's in my inventory? Let's get rid of a hundred stone. Don't need that. Oh, what? Right. Starting from the start. Oh, are you going to put the fuel in there? Yeah. Pop fuel in there. there you go. All right, cool, cool. Too easy. Nice. All right. Aluminium. I will stand guard outside, back front. Iron. Iron, gold, iron. Ah, what a time to get black one. Ah, uh, I'm gonna go get some food. Uh, just up... so you know, it's uh, pretty close to Cole's hard out. Yeah, yeah, we've got five mm. minutes. You call. Yeah, I'll yeah, I'll wait for you, and then we can go back home and. All right, I'll just do a quick scan to see if there's any more titanium hiding up in the rafters. And then we'll scoot so that we can get you back safe. Nice. Damn, black one. Yep. <laughs> All right, that looks like it's it. Oh. Alright, let's get the There's the torches. an unfinished titanium chunk there. Oh, say again? There was an unfinished titanium chunk there. Oh. Grabbed for you. Thank you. Oh, wait, let's scoot. Let's skedaddle. Grab what, the coal. Grab the coal. Oh, if you can. Wait, what? Grab the coal if you can. Oh, from the torches? Yeah. Okay. We just want to turn him off. I uh, I I'm picking him up. Oh, okay, cool, cool, cool. Alright, I've got your call. Call. Nice. Uh, do you want me to pick up the torch, Gemma, or do you want to keep it yourself? 
Uh, I'll, I'll hang on them. Alright, cool, cool. If one of us has them. Ugh, garlic okay. bread, garlic bread is absolutely the best, and yeah, I'm I'm with you all. Cheesy toast at Sizzler, I would always, yeah, that would always be the thing that I would just, just scarf. Now, um, we're probably closer to my base than your where you guys are set up at the moment. If you want to, oh, okay, come okay. back and process stuff there. Yeah, cool. Exotic, on. let's do it. Um, any bed rolls around the place? Uh, there's only one, but I can easily create ah, two more. We've, I've got like thousands of leather sitting. Yeah, there. I've got enough. I've got enough fur and leather for two bed rolls as Yay. well, just from hunting. Yeah, if you've got some food back there, Gemma, that would be awesome if I could. I have one more on, on me. Oh hey. Oh, speaking of food, hey buddy. Ooh, ooh. It's gonna, it's gonna, it's gonna fire my rifle, but I thought, no, not again. Oh dear. Got your wolf. I got your wolf. All right, where are we going, Gemma? Uh, just follow me down to bottom of K13. All right, cool. sure. Ooh, lovely little waterfall there. Oh yeah. Man, magic. Oh, okay. Yeah, I recognise this this environment. Yeah, All right. This is one of the um, one of the default areas for bases. Yeah. Mm. Potato is an excellent food, calf. Oh yeah, yeah. Isn't this the um? Mm. Isn't this the area for the for the first starting mission? Yeah. Uh, that's the area we were at for mm. the last mission. But you I think that as well they use the little it. Little island there. Yeah, yeah, that little island. I'm pretty sure they use it for the very first mission as well. Mm. Uh, yeah. There's a a couple of missions start in that area. Yeah, mm. it's yeah, it's really picturesque. Like it's a. They've chosen in a really good selling point. I love how if you go from memory east from there, mm. um, no west. Yeah, if you head west from there, there's a the nice little creek that runs down into the lake yeah. as well. Yeah, lots of dividing little river rivulets. Yeah. <laughs> no, that's fine, Kath. You need to be true to your people. And I'm still working on my last beer anyway. All right, Cole, we got one minute on the clock for you. Cool. I'll catch up with you all. I still got the black one. Hmm. Ooh, a bit of coal here. Who's this coal? It is. This is coal that I'm feeling. <laughs> Definitely full up now. Where's the other mine there? Oh, that one. Yeah, like this. Some. Um... Yeah, this um, gap into the into the, the snowy area is um, where I spotted my first polar bear. Yeah. And ran in the other direction, obviously, because. <laughs> <Jesus Christ. laughs> um. All right, sorry, folks. I just need to stop for a second, take care of my food because it's critical. Ooh. Yeah, completely fine. I have. A I mean, if if, if if your <laughs> food is telling you you're not worthwhile, then by all means, that's something that has to be addressed. I think so. I think so. Oh. You got some noisy roommates here. Yeah? 
Wow, all the things are in here. Oh, wow. This has got all the stuff. I wouldn't say all, but plenty of. Beautiful. Alright. So, if I was looking to borrow some, or steal some food, where would I find it? Uh, on the uh, fire pit. Okay. The fire pit was out near the cloak, near the... Yeah, there it is. Over here. Oh, okay. Ooh. Now. Huh. Bed rolls? Nothing. Someone said. Do you need uh, backpacks, guys? So you've already, you've already got those. Oh, I've got them. Yeah, thanks. Yeah. Um, you can have this watermelon if you like. Oh, that's okay. I'm just going to cook this meat from the wolf, and then I'll be good. Cute. Nice view, you get a front, you get a front door too. Yeah. So what are we looking forward to this fortnight? Ah, oh, good question. Well, you first, Cole. You raise the question. Well, I am previewing my show on Saturday. Mm -hmm. I'm looking forward to a big, solid week of work. Yeah. <laughs> that sounds awesome. How about you, Gemma? Um, not so much this week coming, which is just going to be chill and getting stuff done. Um, but next week back at uni, which I'm kind of excited for. Yeah. I mean, a week of a week of being chill and you know just being able to do your own thing sounds that sounds pretty damn good. Yeah. But I take your point. Yeah. Um. So a couple of bed rolls here for you. Thank you. If you want. Oh, bless. Right. Nice. I'm going to sleep in front of the machining bench. Got a spawn point. Uh, when I mean eat, eat, eat the wolf, I mean, uh, no, it's an expression, Kath. It's like, you know, you do the most difficult thing that's, uh, you know, to start your day. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Jeez. If I was... I think I'd have to really think to um, think about like what it is that I'm looking forward to this week. Mm -hmm. um, oh, hang on. Sorry. I just turned that off. Um, and just so you know, there is a stone working bench up here. Uh, for oh, cool. When you're ready to do that sort of stuff. Um, gotcha. Yeah. <gasps> it's your birthday in just over a week. Okay. That's awesome. Nice. When is your birthday? Okay. When is your birthday? And goodbye, Soakley. Have a wonderful dinner. It's been lovely having you here. Bye. Thank you so much for your company. All right, Cole. We are five minutes over time for you. Go, go. Um, right. I'm good. I'm good to log out. Um, it's only 11. Thank you for letting us know. Yeah, I'm going to pop out. 30 seconds and I'll be out. Just so I can do the save. Yeah. Thanks for coming along, lovelies. It's been really good to at least have a little bit of a break from the grind. I want to say grind. It's, a, it's an absolutely fabulous job. I'm just overwhelmed. Yeah. <laughs> Need the brain space for a little while. Um, yeah, when oh, it's on. Sorry, I forgot Go ahead. that I had to let you guys fully close out before I quit out because ah. I just quit out and. Ah, doesn't matter. No, I think the only thing that wasn't saved was me having a watermelon. Fair enough. <laughs> All right. Well, now you draw that watermelon again next. <laughs> exactly. 
quiet. All right. Um, yeah, I think. Oh. I think on my head will be in a bit of a better space after Saturday, so I'll, I'll go let you all know if I'm going to be jumping on after that time. And yeah. Mm. Uh, but otherwise, we'll see you in a couple of weeks, I guess. Oh, well, I will. But what have you got on the cards for your next streams? Uh, schedule as usual at the moment, like, unless work gets in the way. Um, it's funny, I need to update, um, I need to update, uh, Lensworth, because when it says, like, Alexa, like, check out Kevin's Alexa work for when he's not streaming at the moment, when I'm doing my own work, it's mostly, um, it's mostly consulting work on Age of, Age of Darkness, which I, mm. is awesome, it's wonderful being able to be involved in a game like that in a ongoing basis, mm -hmm. um, Helping them with everything. It just is, yeah, it's a different um, speed. Uh -huh. Yeah. I did remember one other thing that I'm looking forward to. That is this week. Uh, mm -hmm. That's finishing off Session Zeroes for the Eclipse ca Phase campaign. That I'm oh, fantastic. Mm. Yes, yes. I, um, yeah, I've been, I've been, my brain's been a little bit mush um, this weekend, but I did see you mention that. Um, mm. yeah, I think it was in What You're Doing. I do have one or two spots available if anyone wants to join. Oh. Very cool. Well, you're if you're looking for if you're looking to join a Eclipse Phase campaign, which is a very interesting setting, very interesting world. Mm -hmm. Um, you know where to find you know where to find Story Girl. Great. Indeed. And as for streaming times, uh nothing set. Um mm. I'm one of those weirdos the the more structured my time is around everything else, the more time I make for streaming. When I have no structure to my time, it's like, oh, do I, want to, do I feel like streaming? Nah. <laughs> Understood. All right, then. Well, I'll, I'll get out of here, then. Catch us on the flip side, eh? Have a Lovely great, having Cole. you here, Cole. Have a wonderful week. Lovely having you here as well, Gemma. Thank you for having me. Yeah, and folks, I will be back on Wednesday night, 8.30 p.m. for more cowboying. See you then. Lovely.